Purple gang gang Purple baby. Gang. Purple gang gang. You soda? Oh, hey. Um, are we live? I think we might be live. Are it's we live? Possible. We are live. Happy Saturday. Welcome to Purple Gang Gang Live. Um, we've got a great show in store for you. Allegedly. Been... Allegedly. Yeah. We'll, no. we'll try. I mean, don't set those standards too high. Don't raise the bar. I mean, I'm, I'm no. short. I can't reach that shit. No. We'll grab that bar, and then uh, we'll hang from it for a little while and see what happens. We might fall. We I'm might only good there. for like two pull-ups. Shit. Two. That's... That's impressive. Thank you for joining us early. We uh, modified our schedules a little bit, and then time zones happened. But we'll catch up with all that. We'll figure it out. Um, let's let's go ahead and bump into it. Uh, the first thing I want to acknowledge: Can we talk about our Lord and our Savior, Jeremy Gerard? Who? You know Jeremy Gerard, our Lord and Savior. Oh my goodness gracious! Did you see Mythic Conversations on Wednesday? Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. Oh wow. How many purple parts can I use? Can I find a figure that is head to toe purple? So I give you Van Jordan the purple. This is this is a very special for tonight. Van Jordan the purple. Shout out there to my friends from the Purple Gang Gang. 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 Yeah. Yeah, so that was it. Um, there were, He had a little bit of technical difficulties, and he just kept saying Purple Gang Gang over and over. But that was a super sweet gesture. We absolutely love Jeremy. Um, just the way he used as many purple parts as humanly possible. It really spoke to us on a very purple level. That was like a combination of purple and personal. Yeah, no, I was, I was I It was, was an inspired. amalgamation. Shout out to Mythic Dolphin for explaining ooh, to you ooh. what that was on Saturday Day Live. Appreciate you, Mythic Dolphin. What an absolutely wonderful show with the uh, Sparrow guys. Uh, they're super wonderful. They uh, make monkey toys, cat toys. Hopefully, if we can get some uh, lizard toys, some backer elephant stuff. toys, rhino elephant toys, toys you know, hippo toys. We got to hit these they goals. They make them though. toys, y'all. Purple Animal necromancer toys. bird toys. I mean, who would have thought? Wow, we thought, but so. Jason you know, brought it in fruition. That's pretty badass. So right? if you didn't know, now you know. And but yeah, big shout out to Jeremy. All the love that he's shown us every single minute of every single day. He's a he's a great friend. He is an absolutely wonderful Lord and Savior. So shout out Jeremy. Thank you for all that you do. Another quick shout out to some of our friends in the studio. Uh, Jim, George, and Chris are in. Uh, I think they're actually in Japan right now. They're about to go to China. I just saw Jim post some photos of the guys in Tokyo. Looks like they're having an absolutely wonderful time. So we hope you guys have a blast. Don't do anything Van wouldn't do. If you catch our drift. Is that a Tokyo drift reference? It cool was. Guy. Dad joke. There yeah, we go. I like that. I like that. What's drifting? Drifting when you're not in control unless you're out of control. But um, yeah, big shout out. Big shout out to Jeremy, Jim, George, Chris. We love you guys. Um, Without a doubt. Oh, do we... Do we need to shout out our, our awesome sponsors? I feel like that would be the courteous thing to do. I think we should. I think we should. <laughs> so, you know, if you tuned in last week, you saw we had an absolutely super dope promotion code for Wolf King Customs. It was purple in all caps. If you were one of the, the lucky people to take advantage of this code, it afforded you 20% off site-wide. I, I made an order. I made an order. You made an order. I did. You know, they had a huge parts drop on Monday at noon. Um, I think we ordered every last one of those figures. We got wolves. We've got uh, king wolves. And uh, we even put in shooting the shelf sent us in the comments. And we received this absolutely super dope shooting the shelf shelf purple brick brick. Perfect for throwing through glass diorama windows when you're trying to invade your uh, neighbor's homes uh, and steal their flannel. In 112 scale, we don't uh, advocate for uh, breaking into your neighbor's house in the Unless you scale. say shooting the shelf sent you. That is the caveat. Yeah. So if you do that, you know, Jesse and Curtis approve you doing that. Lynn approves you doing that. They'll post your bill. We don't 
advocate for that, but we're just messengers. Mm. Don't shoot us. Mm. Don't throw a purple brick brick at us. Yeah. If Don't you do, we're going to keep it because we play a lot of dodgeball. We will catch this brick brick. And we'll just keep it. We'll True. take it home. So we'll, we'll build a storage facility for our toys out of those bricks. So yeah. Yeah. That curse is our blessing. But yeah, big shout out to Wolf King Customs. Um, Wolf oh my King goodness. Customs. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry. I apologize for interrupting. But speaking of bricks, speaking of masonry, speaking of one that would quite possibly be familiar with center blocks, we got brick something in the chat. Who? Brick something? Brick, brick something. something. Oh my something goodness, bricks, gracious. yeah. I know brick something. He's a sweet dude. Shout out brick something. Something something. Dark side. Family guy, Star Wars reference. And Mira. Yeah. Oh, is Mira here? She is. So Thank wonderful. you, Mira. Mira has You're been up. putting out some absolutely awesome just customs all around. Yeah. Her journey's inspiring. We just You're a good this. person. We appreciate your energy. We Keep do. it up. We do wholeheartedly. Keep doing you. But uh, before I was so rudely interrupted. Yeah, I, I was quite rude. The next four horsemen street team event it, is yeah, actually gonna be. Event. May, what, is, what does this say here? May 4th. The May day 4th after Van's May birthday. Review. Yeah, so if you want to send uh, Van a birthday gift, check out his OnlyFans Amazon wish list. There's lots of cool prizes and gifts you can send him. You can send them absolutely anonymously. He'll get them. You know, And I'll appreciate them. He'll appreciate them. Yeah. He'll shout you out for uh, sending those. Absolutely. But uh, Four Horsemen Studios, in collaboration with Wolf King uh, Customs, will actually be at the Lehigh Valley Show, which is actually like home turf for the wolf king and uh, it's going to be an absolutely amazing show would you say it's his den i wouldn't say it's his den but it is den adjacent den den wolf yes. den den mm. but uh mm. jesse arnold will be there and uh you know we love some jesse jesse's so sweet and every i believe way. they they he is now known as the flannel ninja <laughs> take that bear oh, I mean, <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> it just kills him. Yep, yep. There you go. So if you want the opportunity to see Jesse giggling with his goat, we often refer to it as Jesse's giggling goat. But here's a hard fact that a lot of you can't stomach. The goat doesn't Eek. giggle. Jesse giggles. But it looks like the goat's giggling. Right. So I'm sorry if you can't sleep tonight. Write your congressman. But if you want to meet Jesse, if you want to meet Lynn, and if you want to wish one of our great friends a happy birthday, you definitely want to attend this show. So, happy birthday, Cookie, today. Happy birthday, Cookie, on May Every 4th. Day. You're great, bro. So, big shout out, Cookie. Big shout out, Lynn. Big shout out, Jesse. Big shout out to Jesse's goat that doesn't giggle, but looks like he's giggling. Because you guys deserve all the shout outs in the entire world. We absolutely love it. And speaking of Leonardo da Vinci LaGuardia, we got a package that arrived at the PGG studio that was sent to us by none other than the Wolf King himself. And we've been aching to open this all week. We it's were been killing that, me. We were yeah. hoping to have it last Saturday. Like shipping was like, it'll be there on Saturday. And then it, it never wasn't. came. So it showed up on Monday. So it's been a very long week. Um, you know, we, we do honor our word Yep. and we promise to open this live on the seal tonight. was broken while we were here with y'all. You saw me, uh, with my little T-Rex hands, uh, struggling yeah. to tear it open. Holy oh fucking shit. I'm going to go ahead and drop my head Oh my goodness gracious. Dude killed us with the shooting the shell. Oh breaks. my God. So we just dropped this reveal like a few oh, minutes shit. ago and then. Now I get why he wanted it to be here Saturday before everybody else got him. That's, Lego that's great. Head. Oh my God, this is the greatest thing that I've ever seen in the history of mankind. And no matter how awesome this is, Lynn is also a man of his word. Yeah, yes. He had told us this was the coolest thing that he has ever printed up until like two Prior days to ago. Today, yeah. Two days ago. Mm. Or maybe it was yesterday. I don't know. Yeah, time's hard to manage when you're with uh, The DeLorean's out of gas downstairs. We haven't been able to go places. Yeah, We're out of 81 miles fuel. an hour at best, yeah. I, I, I ate all the potatoes. Mm. They were good, though. There's no more fuel. Yeah. But wow. Oh, my goodness gracious. This is the greatest thing that I've ever seen in my entire life. A whole bag of shooting the shelf brick bricks. Every last one of these are going to get painted purple. 
Do you have that dope stuff that we bought at Hobby Lobby earlier? Maybe give some people a little bit of plans on what, what uh, we intend to do with them. Buy dope stuff at Hobby Lobby. What are you referring to exactly? Oh, yeah, I'm with you. you. Know. Okay. I think you know You're what I'm talking second. about. No, we talked about it in the chat. So we have actual purple flannel that we are going to cut and wrap around these 112 scale bricks so you can hoist them sons of bitches through a window while you holler out shooting the shelf sent you. And you know what? Um, we haven't discussed this because we didn't know what was in this package. No clue. Uh, every single giveaway winner tonight, let's send one brick with their giveaways. As long as there's still 20 left for me, I'm okay with that idea. Ooh, let's count them real quick. Mm. So, uh, Curtis, uh, go back in time and take away what I just said while I count these bricks. I All right. uh, turning on the time machine now. Oh, Curtis. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Code Lavender. Code Lavender. Yeah, what, I'm what, sorry. What, Did you need me? Oh. Yeah, yeah. Do we, do we have, is there is no life I know to compare with purple imagination. This is not where I parked my car. This is not my purse. What was in that blunt? Living there, you'll be free. It I want a purple Richard Simmons tribute figure now! If you truly wish. Uh, Rosie, save some for later. Bitch, I'm hungry. To be. Wow. Um, <laughs> wow. So. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pleased with myself. I'm not going to lie. Oh, yeah? Okay. Yeah. yeah. That hat is the most beautiful thing that I have ever seen. I'm so uh, happy about that hat. Oh, it's this? It, that keeps, hat. it keeps getting better. We just got a brick of purple uh, shooting the shelf shelf bricks. And then mm -hmm. you come on with this fabulous hat. This is a dope ass hat. I, I just pulled this out of the closet. I, I was having a bad hair day. So um, when you pull it out, you just like boop, pop it up. Or I, I didn't work? even realize that it was purple. Um, oh. But yeah, that's cool. I'm glad you guys like it. Is, hmm. it, is it purple? Is it lavender? It, it I purple? believe it's lavender. Yeah. Now yeah. that I look at it. Um, Absolutely. So, you have too much style for your own good courtesy. Yeah, it is. You know. Is that digital we all, camo? Yeah, we, we all have our crosses to bear. So mm. are you blending in with your detox? Is that detox camo? Where did he I go? Like Where did he go? Oh my goodness, he just disappeared on screen. Wow. Curtis, you're a real one. That's so wonderful whenever see away. Did you count these bricks yet? No, I I thought it was on you. I grabbed like the shittiest tape I could possibly grab tonight. The good news is it looks like we have enough bricks uh, to uh, not go back in time and change my statement. Oh, what you got going on here? More stickers? Well, it's not so much stickers as it's the tape to bind them. One tape to bind them all and in the darkness uh, roll them? Yeah, I'm, I'm having, I'm who, struggling with my tape. Who are you representing on your Firma Hearts? Tonight? Oh, tonight I'm representing our Lord and Savior, Jeremy Gerard and his YouTube channel, which is known as Mythic Customs. He does some good customs. He does. The customs are mythic. And then on the right perma heart, I have none other than uh da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. It's... holy shit, there is that dirt? Oh Woo! my goodness gracious. I was running out of breath. Is that dirt? Hey. Oh how's it going, guys? Did you collect all my beard clippings from last week and glue them to your face? Well, explains it. Yeah, I wanted to uh, wanted to give a shout out to Jordan for sending me, um, you know, his, his beard beard shaving. You know, you're welcome. You no, know, I feel like he's saying something just very poignant at this moment, and that it is disrespectful if we do anything other than give him the entire spotlight. So I don't know what you're talking well, yeah, about. What's on? What's on? Oh, okay. Oh, we're just gonna we're gonna jump right into that. Okay. I did mention that I had something kind of planned out, had some notes, but I'm just going to kind of spitball. So with my uh, 60 seconds here, I want to talk about something very important uh, to me and it should be important to everyone. And that is the importance of hugs. Okay. They say that just to survive, a person needs about four hugs a day. Um, eight hugs is, is good, but 12 hugs is ideal for maximum, um, you know, to keep depression away and stress and all that. So even if you don't have anyone important in your life, um, you can hug yourself. 
that works too. Um, hug an animal, hug a, hug a dog, hug a cat, hug anything really, um, as long as it's consensual. Um, yeah, and the other benefit is it takes two people usually to hug. So not only are you reaping the benefits of the hug, but they are too. So get out there and uh, hug people consensually. So you heard it here first. Would you hug raccoons? And two, oxytocin gets released every time you hug somebody. So that's one. It's science. And yes. two, yep. let us know about those raccoons. Uh, and, you and know, that's, that's extremely progressive. How long have you been into interspecies relationships? Ooh, okay. It was um, in the form. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> A while, never. There's yeah. a little kid, never. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You don't, you don't do it like that. But the raccoons thing. Have you ever hugged a raccoon? Yeah. Was it great? It, it was. They're uh, they're super bristly. Um, you know, so yeah. it's really. I, I never would have grabbed yeah. that. Shout out, yep. Jonathan. Yep, they're very. It's not like cat fur. Uh, it's a lot coarser than cat fur. Um, like pig hair. Kind of like cats uh, that don't grow themselves, right? Yeah, that's wonderful. You had a you had a pet raccoon, if I understand correct. Yes, I did. Yeah, uh, Angus. Um, yeah, she used to. I mean, we had her for a little over a year. Um, oh. She used to sleep in bed. She'd sleep. She'd sleep in front of like a space heater with the dog. She'd sleep in bed oh with God, me, like under the covers. Yeah, they're they're just kind of a weird mix between a cat and a dog, and it's great, right? Cat and yeah, dog. oh yeah, I like that. That's perfect, right? Cat and dog, I like that. We little raccoon oh, possums are dog. great too. Yeah. Did we talk about purple shirts? Purple shirt shirts. Customs? Oh my goodness gracious! We're going back to the sponsors. Yeah. I think we should. Yeah. So live right now at WolfkingCustoms.com, you have the ability to order this purple cabal shirt as well as this. New purple Wolf King custom shirt with a design by David Williams. Now you could get it in other colors, but why would you want to? Yeah. Um, yeah. the Cabal shirt actually only comes in purple. Big shout out Walter. Um, he loves the purple Taco shirt. Bite. Um, that's the only shirt he really wears. Um, if you've ever seen Walter in this shirt and it doesn't look purple, it's because he you sends might want to get your vision checked. He sends us messages and asks us to apply black filters to the shirt. We do that because we love Walter. Um, but really the only color it's available in is purple. So definitely get your pre-orders in this cabal shirt pops up very sparingly. So right now is your opportunity to get this sweet purple cabal shirt in this super sweet dope, dope purple Wolfkin custom shirt. I like so that. Just wanted to throw that out there. If you know, you know, and if you don't know now, you know. Yep. Hmm. Brick, don't put the brick through the laptop screen. No, gosh, no. I got to pay for this thing. Oh, my goodness. Did we have another sponsor shout out? Please don't tell me we're going to talk about my, my. Oh, boy. Okay. I got nothing now. I only I only planned for one. So, okay. That's cool. So, yep. let's talk about the Toy Forge. Then. <laughs> oh, the Toy Forge. Yeah. Ba, 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 ba. Tink, tink, tink. Big shout out to Anthony House Seal uh, this uh, Friday at noon. The spring Jenga. Hmm. Um, stop playing with these brick bricks. I won't give up. This Friday at noon, the new Toy Forge Spring Sale Drop just hit. Lots of great parts. Check out the uh, Toy Forge website. Description is in the comp or the uh, the link to the website is actually in the description to this video. There was a lot of great new sculpts that have never been seen Frank before the tank. that were dropped. An absolutely awesome Frank the Tank head sculpt, which is an homage to his father, to Anthony's father. I believe uh, our, our friend Tiago actually sculpted that. Did That's a really wonderful nice. Wonderful job all around. Uh, we've got the murder bunny that just hit. We've got the new dwarf diver set that just hit. We've got the dryad set. I know I said murder bunny, but we got the murder bunny head. Um, How many murder bunnies did you order? I, I ordered two, just like I said previously on the streams. One to paint purple. Hello, me small. I got two as well. And one to paint like murder. But um, Donnie Darko, son. Why are you wearing that stupid human suit? Mm. Uh, but speaking of that dope, dope diver set, we're actually going to do a little uh, 
little Toy Forge uh, Diver Custom Challenge uh, in the Purple Gang Gang Group Group. It's a Facebook group group where you can share all of your great purple stuff. But uh, whoever comes up with the coolest, greatest, most awesomest Dwarf Diver Custom by the end of May, posted in the Purple Gang Gang Group Group, you're going to get a super awesome, dope purple package package. Um, you'll be celebrated with the gods. No big deal. No big deal. Jump on that. I it's, would. A, it's a great set all around. Get it, Tonto. And uh, we want to see the magic that you come up with. Bro, what are you doing? I, I'm just, I'm living my best life right now. I'm here for it. Yeah. I applaud you. I'm not going to stop you. But Don't. yeah, definitely check out I the Toy Forge. I, I got several. I mean, yeah. Just okay. pretend like it's not happening until it until it is complete. I'm intrigued right now. I, no, like seriously, my biggest challenge is continuing to find like pencils and barbecue skewers to provide stability to it. But Lynn LaGuardia, I hope you're seeing the the amazingness. Yeah, I need theme music, and I'm going to top it off with your purple. But but you still got more that you haven't dude used. found another pencil. Oh, that did not give me the. Uh... <laughs> yep. To yeah. all of you tuning in, uh, if you wouldn't mind hitting the like button while I uh, continue to do my infantile uh, brick building. And while he plays with his uh, purple bricks. brick bricks, uh, I believe we have some more mythic news coming your way. So you heard it here. The Lehi Lehigh Valley Show on May the uh, 4th mm -hmm. in good old Pennsylvania, sure headed by the there. Wolf King Customs Crew. There's another mythic meetup happening. On the other side of the country, purple. Sacramento, purple Sacramento, home of the purple King Kings. Um, it's a mythic meetup at Toy Fusion in Sacramento with our Pulse good friend. Uh, what are you talking about? No, what I'm doing over here, not oh. you. Yeah. Oh, get out of your head, buddy. Mm -hmm. um, but we got a wonderful mythic That's meetup May 4th and the 5th at Toy Fusion in Sacramento, California. It's held at 2230 Arden Way, Sweet A. So definitely show up to that. There's going to be a lot of great people there. Is the Wiz One's going to be there? Walter Hagen, the Mad's going to be there. Nate, the Nate, Bearsh is going to be there. He is the uh, full-time uh, art dude for Four Horsemen Studios. If you've ever seen uh, any of the um, Mythic Legion's art, he's the guy that did it. Tell me that's not cool. Oh, and they sent us a video to play to promote this event? Es possible. Dirk, can you go ahead and play that video for us? Come with me and you'll be at a mythic made up in Sacramento. I've been waiting to speak with the manager. Purple gang gang. <laughs> if that manager has any common sense, it will immediately attend to female slog parts needs. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. So big shout out to uh, IsWiz1 for sending us that promotion video for the Mythic Meetup in Sacramento. Um, we're booked for that weekend. We'd love to be there, but we absolutely support you guys in every single way. We can't wait for it to be a huge success. The West Coast needs all the love and support that it can it can get steve-o I, I hate to see any alcohol wasted so i feel like you 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 deserve recompense um reach out to is ramirez or walter and either one of them sons of bitches owes you a case of whatever it is you prefer to drink that is correct and uh king castle seizure my dude tell them shooting shelf sent you tonight is actually not a willy wonka theme night we were going to go in that direction um that's actually going to be another episode yeah we're one trick where, ponies yeah you know, don't, don't put wanna, that pressure on us we don't want to do the same thing over and over and over um but we absolutely will so that's not tonight though tonight we've got a lot of stuff planned so keep that in mind um we did have two uh three four willy wonka shout outs tonight but uh band's got a golden ticket i've got a golden ticket this is what we do 95% less drunk than I'm used to. Dan, close one eye for is.
Is that funny to you? They say if you love what you do, it's not work at all. And clearly, Diego loves what he does. Yeah, that was your shipping update for uh, PGG Live. So big shout out, Diego. Thanks for uh, all, <laughs> <laughs> uh, That's all you need to know. Once yeah. you know your location, but yeah, absolutely wonderful all around. Uh, mythic uh, four ish o'clock on Wednesday was super delightful with the uh, special guest hosts, Jeremy and Diego. It was uh, it was a good time. It was a good time all around. You, you know what else was a good time? No. You don't? I don't. I'll, I'll don't. share with you. I really enjoyed the time that I had listening to the Euro Legions broadcast on YouTube today. Who? The Euro Legions podcast. Who? Euro Legions podcast. Uh, Thank you, Four Horsemen. <laughs> May I please have another, Governor? <laughs> <laughs> Dance monkey, dance monkey, dance monkey, dance monkey. <laughs> governor, 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 governor. Purple gang gang, governor. Oh, yeah. oh, oh, he wasn't talking to me. Oh, yeah. Um, but seriously, what an absolutely amazing episode of the Euro Legions podcast. They did their Patreon giveaway. Love them, dude. Gave away an absolutely amazing, sharp, and pointy uh, ogre custom by uh, Andy somebody Spades, lost an eye. MK Ultra. Mm -hmm. Um, there was another awesome giveaway giving away uh, Thump Walter, Walter the Mad gave away a Thump to the Euro Legions podcast so they could give away on the show. So, big shout out to Walter for that. Absolutely wholesome in every single way. The purple thing to do. So, Walter. We applaud you for putting on your best purple face every chance you get. We're here for it. And uh, if you guys didn't know, and we mentioned it like probably four minutes and 38 seconds ago, but Walter is going to be at the Sacramento Toy Fusion Mythic Meetup on May the 4th and 5th. Tacos for everybody. He will pump you on the front handlebars of his bicycle. You need a ride, he's got you. Do not, I mean, delete your Uber app, delete Lyft. He's got yes, pegs on the back. He's got a basket on the front. The handlebars are modified with little queso pump. What more could you want? Nachos and limo service. Tacos, burritos, nachos. Orale. But um, oh, we have one more little bit of news here um, from the mythic world. Before we get into more mythic news from the mythic world, uh, our you good got? friends at Mythic Bits. Uh, just actually launched a gallery style website and the uh, fashion of the toy forge so that i understand this they have a site that displays their wares and it is on the web it is on the web okay it thank you for clarifying their wares. you look through this website right here at the bottom and uh you find what you want you go on to facebook or instagram or or email and you send them a message with what you want and right now they're actually doing a special where you get three 1.0 heads for $25 ship. It's a pretty good deal. So uh, definitely take them up on that. They're great people all around, and uh, we're excited to see what they uh, come up with moving forward. I like all that. Yeah, me too. It's really fun. So when we talked about the Toy Forge, and when we talked about the Toy Forge being our sponsor, we made certain that we doubled down on a, a spring sale. And did we also talk about the PGGGG Diver Custom Contest? We absolutely did. I just wanted to make sure that we really emphasize the PGGGG Diver Contest. Yeah, so the PGGGG Diver Custom Contest that is now live 
in the PGG GG Facebook group. Mm. You buy a diver set from the Toy Forge. You paint it purple. You post it in the PGG GG Facebook group. And whoever does the dopest PGG GG purple diver Lama. dwarf custom wins a dope PGG prize package. Right. What more is there? What more can I say about it? I'm good with that. Uh, if, if you wanted to say one more thing about it. Woof. That's you it. know what? I'll tell you what. I want you to play a song. The first person, Curtis, Code Lavender. Uh, yes, sir. All right. So Jordan just bought a harmonica today, but he's been working hard. He's diligent. He, he's very studious. Mm -hmm. I want him to play a song. The first person in the comments, Dirk and Curtis, you monitor it so we're impartial. The first person who guesses it correctly wins the first PGG prize tonight. Okay. Jordan, play a song. In Missouri. Apparently, I found out that my Missouri education was just that. It it, it was not all that all was cracked up to be. My whole life, I would get a little mad inside. But inside, I get a little mad at that person. In Missouri. I got mad. I got mad. I got mad. And I got mad in Missouri. Here, I've been misjudging. And I've been uh, holding it against folks my whole life. Um, and I'd just like to say for all you folks that I didn't talk to, but I was mad inside about. Turns out I was wrong in Missouri. And I'm sorry because it's not often that I admit I'm wrong in Missouri. But my education failed me in Missouri. Here I've been misjudging. Turns out I was wrong. 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 There you go. I got mad. There you go. I got mad. There you go. Turns out I was wrong. Here, I've been misjudging. Gang gang, baby. I would get a little mad inside. I got mad. But my education failed me. In All right, here we go. Oh, wow. Without so, further ado. Who can guess the song that was the just The first played? person. The first person. It was already played. We're talking about psychics. It? Nobody, With your nobody. extra sensory perception. Do it nobody. one more time. I, no, I feel bad. Go ahead and do it one more time. Doctor Brent, Doctor Brent, Doctor Brent, Doctor Brent. So, who can guess the song now? Play the song, Jordan. I just did twice. And eh, do it a third time With, uh, without any interruptions. Yeah, because we're gonna be. Yeah, we're gonna give him a shot. I just I give him a shot. Give him a shot. No, more of a shot. You got this. I don't know what you're even talking about. Don't stop. Don't stop. My name is. <laughs> uh, I, I... I hope we don't steal my Jesus. That old man stole my Jesus. So um... you were close, Kirby, but not quite. Yeah. It was uh, Steve O's right. It was, it was my home. It was my my lovely lady home. It, it just wasn't. It though. wasn't. Um, Schmerber, I, I I feel. Oh oh oh! Evil stick, evil stick. Okay, wow, talented, talented. Does that mean it's time for a giveaway? It, no, that's the Halva Guitar Weapons Pack with a purple pulse rifle rifle going to stick. I think I already have your address, and we'll get that out to you, my brother. I'm tone deaf stick, so big shout out um, for guessing those beeps uh, and boops. Yep. So, yeah. Beeps and boops, y'all. So not it all happens. of our giveaways are based off of luck. Some of our giveaways are based off of skill. Right. You stick, you've got the skills, brother. So big That's shout true. out. What is my MK Ultra password again? You said like Cheddar or something? I never wrote it down. It's right here. Okay. Cheddar reindeer. Barfanugan. So ignore what you just saw. If you ever see Van in person, never say, you know, otherwise he'll turn into a chicken. Uh, if you don't believe me, you know, maybe we'll test it later, but just wanted to throw that out there. Oh my goodness gracious. Where are we at? Where are we at? You tell me. I just work here, sir. I, you know what? what our our buddy Jason 
Benvenu was, he's not a worldly man. He's stuck in the central time zone. So we kind of, why don't we talk about dirt? You're our guest tonight. Can we talk about uh, customs contest results maybe? Sure can. Yeah. Uh, real real quick. Uh, I just, I had a message from Darla, so I needed to jump in real quick. Uh, she wanted me to remind you that you guys do have a guest tonight. Uh, Dirk here. So, yeah. Thank we you, Darla. We love you. It's the one for the ride. So, Dar Darla's the best. Yeah, that's great. What you got for us, brother? Got the contest um, over the month of March. Uh, oh Dirk's God. Designs and Dwarf Lord Toy Design hosted a action figure um, Mythic Legions um, custom figure contest, but also had categories in art and photography that's so we art. could include everyone in the community as much as possible so i did hear about this on purple gang gang live as well as facebook and instagram as well as the uh, dirk's designs and customs uh, facebook page um yeah, what's our first category that. first category is the art category um which we only had two entries so um okay okay so uh, i guess yeah. we'll uh, go ahead and hit it with the uh, second place winner <clears throat> yep second place winner first here all right, let's uh, do a drum roll here. Ba -da 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 -da. Yeah. Shout out to Mav. Mav. Uh, uh, yep. I like it, a Maverick salad. Awesome, yeah. awesome, awesome. Uh, I love that, Gene. That's the Red Death. So. I, I don't speak that. I don't speak that. Mav, if you're in the comments, how do we say your last name? But uh, that's you know, what Mav, I got. Mav has been everywhere lately. Yeah. He was actually the. Uh, um, highlighted customizer from the Curtis customizing studio sponsored by Wolf King customs um, for the month of or in April now. So the month of March. So big shout out Mav. Not only are you killing it in the customizing studio, your artwork is absolutely baller in every single way. So big mm -hmm. shout out to Mav, uh, with your red death mask, you know, art comes in many forms and fashions. While you're getting place number one, I couldn't help but notice a Vero Atlas has entered the chat. That uh, is uh, uh, very well Atlas. So I, I will be right back. We love Eddie. Eddie's yeah. wonderful. No, Barrel Atlas. You stay over there. And while he's uh, falling down the stairs. Thump, 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 thump. Oh, he's coming back. Don't worry. Fans, fans coming back. He always comes back. Vero Atlas has an absolute place of honor in the Purple Gang Gang studio. He actually yeah. protects the studio. He's actually on the banister. Rocking the shit out of this purple dragon dragon. Yes, indeed. This was actually the prototype Four Horsemen Studios used when they made the new dragon that we hopefully should be getting this year. Not true at all, but hey, we're going to go with that story. That so was, That was a lie. Vero Atlas, Check that we hashtag. love you. God bless your family, and God bless yeah. your newest addition to the family who is beyond adorable. Boom. Yeah. I got, mine. I got mine here, too. Throwing oh, some of the uh, Boxes. All that Vero Atlas <laughs> love. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. That's beautiful, bro. What a wonderful figure. What a wonderful take with that sweet purple cape cape that you threw on there. Mm -hmm. I'm here for it. Oh, yeah. I love that. That's so great. Uh, I'm back. Yep, sorry. He's back. Yeah. Uh, Eddie is back protecting our stairwell. It's a choke point. Mm. Nobody can get past Eddie. It's true. Just write that down. Mm. You should know. Oh, did we say something about a uh, first place art uh, yep. winner? We talked first about the place. first place winner. Oh, my God. I like that. Oh, this I one like was awesome. And it had an accompanying like custom figure with it. This one, this one was great. Absolutely love it. Wow. That's gorgeous. Wow. Yeah, no, a figure and Nailed artwork. That. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, is that digital art? Is that, um, are those I think so. color pencils? That, no, that's clearly cave art. I'm pretty sure it's digital. No, it's cave art. Yeah. yeah cave art, okay. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's, it's yeah, our no. show. It really is beautiful in every single way. Like to be able to, to, to render that. Yeah, no, I'm envious for sure. And then to create it, manifest it in physical mm -hmm. form. Absolutely beautiful. Um, oh, yeah. Yep. And I, I'm going to butcher this name. Zen? Zing? iPad Procreate. Okay. 
Super dope. Oh, there we go. He's in the chat. Good. You, you did. You Congratulations. did. Uh, exemplary art. We appreciate you sharing that with the community, and and clearly you deserve the win. Thank you. Thank you for sharing your heart and your talent with all of us. That's, that's what's about. Shout out, Shane. Love you, brother. Thank you. That was wonderful. Yeah. Appreciate yeah. it. Yep. Yeah, no, super. Thank cool. you for correcting my ignorance. Yeah, we're learning. Yeah, we're not. You know, we're not going to live like this forever. I, I wanna, am the. I am the first to admit, you yins. I was raised in North Carolina, transferred to Dallas, Texas. I'm as Southern as one can be, but I'm also humble. If, if I say something incorrect, you do not hurt my feelings in any way, shape, or form by telling me the correct way to say it because it hurts my feelings knowing I that I'm. Yeah, knowing that I'm butchering your name bothers me more than than you would ever know. So, so thank you for telling me the correct way to say that. I'll never forget. Yeah. Nope. Most likely, I'm, I'm anticipating butchering a couple them. couple names tonight. So no, no worries. Don't, don't no. own it. They no, will, yeah. they will yeah. change the pronunciation. The glass is almost empty. Name. We're good. They will change the pronunciation of their names mm. if you say it. <laughs> Manifested. I was homeschooled, so I. Uh... Same. Clearly, that was a very intelligent home. I lived in the school. I lived in like the gym and uh, the trailers in the back with the uh, in school suspension kids. Oof. Oh, yeah. Okay. So okay. I brought a whole new meaning to homeschool. I'd rather not talk about <laughs> my upbringing, but yeah. Yeah, let's uh, let's get past that. Uh, what's the, the next that. category for the Dirk's Customs let's contest? Go. Photography. This, this one, again, lots of. Awesome, awesome entries. Um, they did not make judging easy, that's for sure. Oh, wow. Looks we like had some honorable mentions, okay? These are ones that I, I just really liked them. Um, going to reach out to these individuals, and we're going to kind of figure out what, uh, what prize they want for honorable mention category. But uh, just a nerd dad, right? Had the pleasure of meeting him there at ZoloCon. And Jason. this is just an awesome, yeah, awesome, awesome, awesome picture dude. of the Valiant Knight there. Awesome. Love it. Awesome Love dude. It. Awesome artwork. Uh, Jason and Maddox, they're just like two of my favorite people. So super mm -hmm. awesome meeting them at ZoloCon. That's when we first met them as well. Um, as far as like uh, everybody that we're highlighting right now, should they just like reach out to you, like DM you directly? Or uh, how should we go about this? Uh, either or up? if they want to if they want to reach out um great if not i'll be reaching out over the next couple of days it's going to take me just a little bit of time to get everything like packaged and shipped out so i'm waiting waiting on some boxes uh from amazon so okay that's, that's the only thing so too easy too easy um yeah. let's see here let's uh let's see what we got on this next slide big money no whammy Oh my goodness gracious, another honorable mention. Now, yeah, let me ask, do, does Mira win the consensual hug or is there what was what, the prize here? I, I saw dwarf the, toys the, drop in there, yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> I yeah, I mean, hey, I'll hug people all day. You heard it here first. Oh, there we go. Wait, yep. What year is it? I have no idea where I'm at right now. Okay. Yeah. So um, reach out to Dirk uh, or he'll reach out to you if he doesn't hear from you. If uh, neither of you reach out to each other within, let's say, eight days, all of your prizes are forfeited to Purple Gang Gang Live. And yeah. We'll give them away live. Speaking of that, it, if yeah. you were a winner during last week's live stream, please reach out to us, whether it be through our page, the, the Purple Gang Gang Facebook page, whether it be the, through official purple gg at gmail.com, whether it be wholesome warlock on Instagram or added underscore toy underscore dude on Instagram. Hit us up. If we don't hear from you within a week of you winning, it's going to go back in the prize box and the prize pool for yeah, sure. And, so, yeah, yeah, hit us up within yeah. seven days. We don't want to get you your prize. You we want exactly. to get you your prizes, but in the event that. You know, we can't confirm who you are or you just don't reach out to us, period. We're just going to recycle your prize and just keep paying it forward and give it to the next person Precisely. Uh, that deserves it. But, um, you know, you know who you are from last week. Just shoot us a DM. It's that we easy. We don't want to call out names. We don't but... bite unless you ask. Yeah. We do bite, though. 
Yeah. Um, so so able. big shout able. out Mira. Wonderful shot all around. I um, love Mira. She's great. I've been following this contest. This, picture, obviously. this one was showcased on Shooting the Shelf last week. And Mira mentioned that the the wood and stuff that the, the figure was taking the picture of is like a bench or like a stool. Mira, is that true? Is Dirk lying? Let us know in the comments. Uh, as a representative of shooting the shelf, I can confirm that that is correct. Um, while you, excuse oh, me, go. Code Lavender, while you're on the screen there, mm -hmm. um, I, I couldn't help but notice that Jordan invoked the name that is shooting shelf. And I feel like there was another, you know, just monumental uh, maybe thing that happened that was lifted yeah. last week. Can you tell do, us a do you bit care more to comment that? on that? Um, yeah, I mean, as, as, hold on, let me, let me just lower this real quick so I can talk to the people, um, Please. as a representative of shooting the shelf, um, I can tell you that, um, I am just a co-host. Um, it is Jesse's channel. Um, the channel was going long before I got there. Um, I'm really a guest for the most part. Um, I don't get to make the rules. I have to follow the rules there. It's, it's his thing. I'm not sure why there was an embargo um, on Richard Simmons. Um, and I also don't know why it was lifted. I don't know if it was temporary or if it's permanent. Um, you're really going to have to ask Jesse those questions. I would ask them on behalf of Purple Gang Gang, but I, I just, I'm afraid that I'm going to get kicked off the show. Uh, I've seen him at his worst, uh, AKA set up and tear down of a show. And I don't want to be on his bad side again. It, it is, it's not fun. Um, and I just don't know any other show that's going to pick me up at this point. I've burned a lot of bridges. So yeah, there you go. And thank you for weighing in on that. I mean, that's, that's Valid. a lot to deal with. And, Valid. and Adam power, I don't know why, but you mentioned that stool is massive and it's, Oh, Billy, I, I, I don't know anything other than it, it just conjures something in the mind. So without further ado, oh, oh Bill. shit. Billy yeah. Beige here. Since last week, there's been an incident with those monstrous, I mean, lovable, lovable caravan critters involving a customer's upholstery and a quote, metric ton of shit. I've been inspired to start a side hustle. Billy's Bayou Bio Fertilizer. Using the ground up bones of roadside culinary masterpieces, Mississippi's finest mud, and the patent pending secret ingredient, the overflow from the caravan sewage tank, I am quite proud to be running a truly green business in Mississippi in 2024 and saving on city sewage and dump station fees. So stop on by Billy's Bayou Bio Fertilizer or any approved retailer this planning season. Billy Beige. Remember, our poo is the shit. Oh, blast it. What did I tell you caravan critters about throwing the poo around here? You're messing with my profits. Bart, round these critters up and give them a little bit of that act right. I'm getting too old for this shit. Mm. Billy, what's wrong with you? Mm. That's a lot going on there. But I'm here for it. Uh, you know, we... We're purple, but we also like to be green as well. So composting is great for the environment. It's great. To, it's very resourceful with the recycling. And um, it's just like that uh, first uh, South Park uh, Christmas episode where Mr. Hanky the Christmas poop comes around and kisses people. Hi and leaves like little, little now, green stains. Here's so my thing. Out. I, I, am, I do not proclaim to be a, a scientist or someone in the healthcare field by any means, but I have to wonder, Dirk, is raw sewage something you should really be mixing into compost, like raw sewage? Yeah. Yeah. Probably yeah. not. Yeah. We'll see how it plays in Mississippi. Yeah. Well, uh, Mississippi, yeah. may, they may operate under different laws that, you know, you know they may take something we don't try to grow. They know something we don't know, maybe. And speaking of Dirk's custom contest photography, I think we've got a third place winner coming up here. Yes. Who that might be. Oh. Oh, my goodness. Robert Crockett. Crockett. Ba, 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 ba. Mm. Beautiful shot. 
Sly like Gore. Definitely a, a group favorite here. Yeah, but what I, I see some backlight going on, and there's a there's a hue that's uh, dare I say purple. It looks purple. It does. It looks mm -hmm. purple. Mm -hmm. It looks so purple. Looks like too that he he even like highlighted the skull. Like there's like a little bit of light, like on the cheekbones and stuff. Like mm -hmm. his suit has like some lights that are casting up. Like it just this was a solid one. I'll go ahead and say what the gang gang is thinking, and with all due respect to our guest, how is he gonna show all this just purple, <clears throat> just swag and 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 rate third place? But I you didn't know. judge. I didn't judge. Robert, reach out to me after the stream. We'll do you right. No, but seriously, no. I mean, you know, <laughs> you know. You know, but seriously, no, this is a wonderful shot all around. And, no, I like uh, that. With this being said, Robert, shoot Dirk a DM for your chance at glory. Hmm. That was a good movie. Matthew Broderick, you guys mm -hmm. ever seen Glory? Let us know in the comments. Oh, that was that was a phenomenal movie. Yeah. Morgan Freeman. That was a good one. Mm -hmm. Shoot out Civil War, not like the movie that's going on in theaters right now where Texas and California secedes from the Union. And uh, Shang, it is not a bias. Not a bias. It's not a purple bias. It's, it's uh, a way of life. Purple love, love. Yes, it's about that wholesome. But you know what? You can't get a third place winner without a second place winner. Hmm? Wait, what? Hmm? Second place winner. Plastic Platorium. Oh my goodness. Tell what us about this won? shot, Dirk. This one, this one's got a lot going on. This one is fun. Uh, we've got what I'm guessing is like a little cavern of uh, goblins here getting attacked by I, I can't remember what they call those from the witcher Mora. there we go that just made that creepy up. spider Smart dude life, just uh messing these guys up so you can you can kind of uh, feel some cool. of the y'all see an attack and y'all see some violence going on but what i see is a key party Shout out to the 70s. If you got a pineapple on your front porch, we know what you're rocking. Congratulations to uh, Plastic Platorium. Yeah. You're the second no, place winner. This is a great shot. And it doesn't look like he's invading. It looks like he's just showing up for a good time. So I right. Yeah. I see no. that. Um, yeah. Shout We're out to the Witcher. Boundaries. Exactly. Shout out to the Witcher. You know, I feel like goblins should ride on him. Speaking of the Witcher, Dennis Derby is one of the just absolutely most wholesome people I know. If you speak his language, if if you need any assistance with your with with your painting or just with your overall existence in this world, reach out to that gentleman, tell him shooting the shelf sent you, and brace yourself for your response. Yeah. And Love remember, you, Dennis. Two exclamation marks. He's too busy. To give you any time, three Reason exclamation marks. That's the Dennis Derby seal of approval. I got three today for the head sculpt that I painted uh, of the four of the four ball goblin. You got a fake three, so I kind of feel like the the Ooh. new three is four. Yeah, no. You, wait till you see the response I got. Be, wait, okay. I don't, yeah, no, it lifted. Okay, me. it lifted. There's it stuff lifted I don't me know. like Samson. I'm just saying. Uh, chocolate reindeer. There it is. Oh. So. Chocolate reindeer doesn't impact me whatsoever. Yeah, I know. That was a test. It was you a test. Passed. I passed it. So you can't have a second place winner mm -hmm. without. <clears throat> first place? A first place winner. There it is. Thanks for uh, those words. I needed those. Uh, big shout out to Beer Man Photography. Is that a Jared Beer Man? Yep. 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 That's, that's got a shot. Do you like Red Death? I've uh, seen two Red Death photos so far, and I love every single one of them. I like oh, yeah. the smoke, I like the pumpkins, yes. I like the skulls, I like the stones, and I'll shut up and Jared tell us what you like. No, this uh, all I mean all the same stuff. The 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 lighting, the smoke in the background, the display, like what looks like like a little like moat, kind of like a little bit of water. Um Underneath the, uh, oh, there we go. I can't see the picture though. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, 
the smoke in the background is is on point. Yes. Smoke is great. Yes. The smoke is the best part. I also love the smoke. Well, it's not the love about smoke. But I do love the composition of the photo. Mm -hmm. Everything complements the centerpiece in the photo. Um, yep. The pumpkins. I feel like it's, uh, this is Halloween. This is Halloween. 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 Yep. Definitely got some of those vibes. But yeah, no, seriously, he absolutely nailed this photo. He's a great dude all around. He does wonderful work. If you haven't seen any of the shadow boxes he's been posting, you definitely need to like check him out because he does great work all around. Oh, yeah. Not only the photography game, dios, customs, mm. just a great dude. I want a purple death as well. Wholesome, recognize wholesome. Mm -hmm. So big shout out to the first place winner of the photography category for the Dirks, uh, you know, custom design contest. We're really proud of you. We really mean that. So great job, buddy. Great job all true. around. Um, do you happen to know what the uh, next category is? Mm. The yeah, custom Mythic Legion figure. Um, I guess they were Be saying amateur. Beginner. The, uh, the beginner. beginner. There we go. Yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. I knew that, Curtis. Oh, this little guy? We got another honorable mention. Paul Nicolasi? Paul Nicolasi? What's up, dude? Awesome little goblin here rocking the, um, the fun house. Um, I can't remember which of the two. Um... Cesar Tyler and Woolward Bordorf. That's what I said. Yeah. Two brothers. Mm -hmm. Two brothers. Yep. I'm yeah. not sure where those pauldrons are from. Those are. Mm. That was one thing. I know the, I know the base Narnia. body is a. They're from Narnia. I recognize it. Narnia. Aslan made yeah. those. Yeah. If anybody recognizes these pauldrons on this dope goblin custom, let us know in the comments. Shout out the Reapy Cheap. The on body's on Lord of the Rings. Oh. Who wore those in the loader? Wait, what? Hmm. The, when, um, I can't remember, it's either Frodo or Sam when they're in the goblin disguise. Hmm. Is he making this up? That's what the. Making? Hey, no. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Curtis, find out Google Lens reverse image search this. Tell us where those pauldrons came from. Mm. I don't know. I think he's messing with us, but I, I also trust him. So I don't I don't know. I'm conflicted right now. Pauldrons, yeah, I have no idea about the pauldrons, but the, the base body I'm I'm very familiar with. So. The base body. Got it. Yeah. I know you do base some absolutely body. awesome toy biz golem work. So um <clears throat> Don't try to figure out where the pauldrons came from, for that is impossible. You must realize that the pauldrons were never there. Ah, ah, that's Valid. so profound. Valid. Appreciate we're it. We're wasting time on things like, yeah. that don't matter. Please continue, okay. Dirk. Right. With purple wisdom, wisdom. Yeah. It's the hat. It makes him more intelligent. <laughs> All right, who we got on uh, third place here? Oh, my goodness. Third place is next. Sebastian. Wow. Yep. This was, this was an awesome one. The um I'm I'm guessing it is the red um uh, demon head that he dry brushed black, but a variable could be any of the other two, yellow or blue. And you never know. Yeah. It's definitely the head pack. Never one. know. It's definitely the head pack yeah. one for sure. Yeah. Without a mm -hmm. doubt. I'd rather leave it to be a mystery and say we never know. But go ahead. Yeah. Yeah, and then uh, you know the skull and the hands and the the sweet uh, the eyes yeah. really the eyes really pop on this one too, um, and just like the the contrast with the red straps and everything, this one was this one was a really cool one. Which is really crazy because the eyes pop right because they're mm -hmm. so bright mm -hmm. white. But mm -hmm. if you listen to anybody yeah. that ever gives you advice on painting eyes, they're like, mm -hmm. don't paint your eyes white. Eyes aren't white. Yeah, but they're also they don't they don't have they don't have pupils and irises so you can go straight white and that's fine those are the same eyes that i see in the middle of the night that are peeking through the closet door just ever so slightly see, clearly your demons are more friendly than mine because they're like the color of oil and they just move fluently and it's like i don't want to talk about it anymore Hello, continue Dirk. let's go to, let's go to second place second place second place here congrats sebastian oh, oh. second place 
Bye. Oh, shit. All right. What? All right. Second what? place here. Jordan. All right. These, these just, just a real quick disclaimer, right? These were chosen prior to knowing I was going to be on the show. So before you know, there's any issues with uh, bias or anything. Um, yeah. If there's any this issues one, bias, now, please send Curtis a DM and let him know your display. <laughs> yeah. Shooting the shelf send you. So why don't you, why don't you talk about this one, Jordan? Um, yeah, absolutely. So um, it's a very, very beginner custom. I threw on the most beautiful cape CBD as you might have referred mm -hmm. to them in the past, man. Cape by Darla. Actually, I believe that was uh, coined by Mark Seal with Funhouse Customs. Yes, indeed it was. Um, but a two-tone purple cape cape by the absolutely beautiful and wonderful in every single way, Darla Ackerman. Um, and really the only custom part about this is this absolutely super dope 3D printed head from Wolfkin Customs. It's the yep. Sir John of Firehead, uh, which is uh, a tribute to our great friend, um, Jonathan Denap, Hedgehog Action from Saturday Day Live. I went ahead and just hit it with some gold and some purple and threw on the Arizak, uh, what you call it, you know, that thingy thing. So that, that's pretty much that all I did. Arizak, like gold piece is really, really cool on this one. And it looks it, like it matches like it fits. almost perfectly. I didn't paint yeah. anything on here other than the sword, which the sword I actually jacked my golden goblin gladiator which is another shout out to it. Jonathan Denaf because uh, he did a Golden Goblin Gladiator. And, right. um, you know, the last uh, reveal way for the reinforcements, you know, I really wanted a Golden, Glob Golden Goblin Gladiator reveal. So I made a whole bunch of memes uh, teasing that every single person was about to uh, reveal a Golden Goblin, Goblin Gladiator, which never manifested. So I made my own, and this is actually the sword for my Golden Goblin Gladiator. So much love, big shout out. Um, but enough about this super dope Sir John of Fire custom. What else we got here? Yeah, it who, says Jordan that? Frazier and and littering and oh my goodness. What next slide? Here we please. go. So um okay. there's some text up here, which means we don't need to talk about it. So let's go on to the first place winner. Hmm. Just kidding. Go ahead. <laughs> no. That's funny. Yeah, like let's that. hear about yeah. it. Oh good. Oh, so there's a kit there. It's uh, got a conquistador theme, and it's got a slightly bent sword. and And I'm fairly certain I made a mistake and put red shield soldier um, thigh pieces on there. And so I had to like reach out to community because I got like this OCD, and now I knew I had a red shield soldier that did not have any thighs. But that's my curse to bear. I feel like the boots might have came from Sabadon. And yeah, you really shouldn't pick me to be a winner because I'm horrible with remembering where stuff came from. I just know that I slapped I, some paint I on it. Think, I think I know Jason Rodriguez had a like, Thank you. And, door. And, yes, and, and PA just printed it for me. Uh, PA just that's okay. uh, no, Peter Pete Johnson, Johnson Customs uh, in Farmville, North Carolina. If you're listening, Yay! let us know in the comments. And then we got uh, some columns from Nimai, and that's definitely a uh, Crashbox Customs Dio. And I'm pretty sure that's awesome a brown. I made a treasure chest. And uh, just to ease everyone's minds. We're not accepting any uh, prizes nope. for this. Nope. It's not rigged in any single way. Nope. No prizes. Um, thank you for, speak, for recognizing. Speaking it. of the second place winner prizes, hey, let's give those away live right now on Purple Gang Gang Live just to show how not rigged it is. Yeah. Let's go so, on a plastic journey right now and give away some dope prizes. So hashtag second place or wholesome. All right. That's, that works too. So do we put something up or is is this the winner that would have been for us? Um, I don't know. We can do it either way. We can give away whatever. I, I tell you what. Let's let's go ahead and uh, grab something from what, the uh, whatever the prize would have been for second us. place. Reach out to Dirk, and then yep. in honor of WrestleMania and the Undertaker Hold stepping up. in. Let's yep. sweeten the pot on this. Keep going what you're going, but I'm going to grab something to sweeten this up with. The the Undertaker stepping into WrestleMania, who happens to be 
my personal favorite wrestler. I, I'm going to throw this into the pot. So we got what Dirk's offering, The Undertaker, and then uh, we might have, uh, did the devil go down to Georgia and brought us a toy, Ooh, for nice. toy forge fiddle. So oh, nice. it, it does not have to be the undertaker playing the fiddle. Not that I doubt his ability to just be a complete virtuoso when it comes to his fiddle playing abilities. If you want to put this on a GI Joe, if you want to put it on a pony, uh, my little, if you want to put it on a Barbie, it's, it, they're your toys. It's your plastic journey. Uh, Jared's be sending something as well. Whomever wins the hashtag wholesome is getting one, two, and Jared as well. Those are your prizes coming to you. So take some time to enter. How are we looking? I real quick the just to, I don't think I I think it was on one of the posts a hot minute ago, but I can't. Wise, read. I'll think the word. Um, First, first place, all right, has their has their pick between Valiant Knight or the Skull Man. Shit. All right. You brought I got fire, um, some 3D printed parts as well. Second place, everyone is uh, Door Floor Toy Design donated a bunch of the um, cavern doors. Cavern doors. And then a whole wow. bunch more. Oh. Is it too late for parts. me to take back this hashtag wholesome shit and go ahead and get that door <laughs> sent to me? <laughs> we can still enter this uh, contest and uh change the there you go and not tell anyone there it is that's how we win we're on this third place um third place is going to be a mix between some um some mythic legion fodder some 3d printed parts um just kind of a whole hodgepodge of of uh mythic legions goodness so yeah I made an angry Jesus because of that. I know I had to throw it up. I love so. it so much it in every single way. He really is witty and brilliant. Right. Oh my goodness. So <laughs> there is an actual um hashtag wholesome entry going on right now. Um we got 46 entries already. There's 70 people watching. Let's go ahead and get some uh oh, we lost one. Speaking of which, uh 69. If, nice. if you, it, yeah, I appreciate that. If you happen to be in the stream right now, if you would take just a moment of your time to hit the like button, don't do it for me, don't do it for Jordan, don't do it for Jared, don't do it for Curtis, do it for the algorithm. Um, I don't need them kicking in my door. It's not that I, it's not that I fear the personal violence, but I have a young son, and I have a daughter, and I have a, a puppy, and I have a wife, and they are just not, they they just have not been desensitized to the violence. So spare them. Of the algorithm violence, and if you, if you just have a moment, hit that like button. We appreciate it. Shout out to a clockwork, a clockwork orange. A little Absolutely, bit of the ultra violence. Yeah, the ultra violence. Catch us at the milk bar after the show ends. It's going to be a lot of fun. Take our head mask. Yes. Hello, my droopy. Uh, I have that mask. Go. He does come with that mask, by the way. Uh, I nice. guess. Share screen. Let's just prove, more. Let's prove to everybody this is an actual real hashtag going on right now. Let's, let's get see. it. And I'm also going to throw out there, if you win a prize, please reach out to us, whether it be through our Facebook group, whether it be for our Instagram, whether it be through our email. I try my very best to get everything mailed out on Monday, but I can't do that if you do not respond to me. So... Please respond to me. If you don't respond to me by the next show, I want to give you your prize. And whether you're into that prize or not, like let's say you think that wrestling is shit. I get that. But your next door neighbor may enjoy it. There's, hell, I don't care. Hand it to a child or just reach out and say, hey, thank you. I want to pay it forward. Give it to the next person. And or we'll you, do that. Or if you see a homeless person that's asking for change, hit them with this undertaker. Mm. Let them know the eBay eBay resale value and tell them to go out and make his own money. Right. So um, I, 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 you don't have to do that, but if you want to do that, I just want to pull this comment up one more time, real quick here, because um, uh, Nathan's on point. Shout out King Castle Seizure. This is um, this is true. So mm. love. 
Rosie has never pushed me down a flight of stairs. Rosie! <laughs> Rosie! That's how you trigger my PTSD. Yep. <laughs> the night's still young. Big money, no whammy. Right. So we're going to give everybody, um, you know, uh, two hours to type in hashtag wholesome. Oh, that shit. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Hit it. Two hours. And if anybody's out there, whether it be Curtis or whether it be Guisagari, Echevarrio, KJ, 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 KJ Smith, winning The Undertaker. Congratulations, KJ Smith, who happens to be a, a fan and or contributor of Highly Posable. Yeah, shout out to KJ. Yeah, yeah, Dope yeah. Dude all around. Yes, Catch him on Friday nights. Um with our homie YL and Corey. Um, they put on a- Fans of them both. Yeah. Just great, great dude all around. Fans of the trio. Check them out. KJ, send us a DM. Either, you know, Facebook, Instagram, Wholesome Warlock, Tatted Toy Dude, Facebook, Van Johnson, Jordan Frazier, Facebook, Purple Gang Gang. Send us a DM, bro. We'll get this right in the mail to you. And you got an Undertaker, uh, a dope fiddle of evil, Painted and printed by the Toy Forge himself, Anthony Halseal. Um, and, and a brick. Looks like there's a shooting the shelf brick brick in there as well. So Just definitely put it in paint there. it purple. Throw it through your neighbor's window and uh, reap the benefits. So Your KJ, neighbor's Dio's window because this is 112 scale. That is yeah. correct. Yeah, so, it won't go through the window. Appreciate you. I think I said Facebook, but... Um, oh, 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 stop everything that we're doing. Stop everything that we're doing. I would like to make an announcement. Toy Culprits has entered the building. Shout out Colin Culp, one of our homies. We had a great time with him. Love that guy. Anna. Love He's that wonderful. guy. If you're not following him on uh, YouTube or Facebook, you're not living your life culprits. to the greatest. You're cheating yourself, really. Absolutely. Don't do that. You're going to have a hard time finding a nicer individual. You, you really are. Mm -hmm. Just wonderful man, You know, beautiful family. And he's just all about lifting up others. I don't know that I've ever heard him say anything just like remotely negative towards anybody. I mean, no, he just, does that in private. Yeah. We would never hear it. Nope. Cullen. Yeah. Keep living your best life because we appreciate what you do, Cullen. If you got any shade to throw, you let us know. Please. We haven't heard it yet. No, but seriously, we love you, Cullen. Tommy, You're the bourbon's out. You're wonderful. No, I love Colin. I can't wait to see him at Ishcon August 3rd in yeah, Durham. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At the Durham Convention Center. Yeah. You know who else is going to be there? Hey. It's, it's going to be you. Oh. Yep. Yep. yep, yep. Yeah. Uh, Door Floor Toy Design and I will be there set up. It'll be a good time. I'm so excited. I am too. You guys have, have you already started planning the awesome Dirk and Door Floor Toy Design? Uh, you know, booth action mm -hmm. for Ishcon. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I've got a couple, couple things in the works. So well, three okay. times. don't necessarily oh. want to spoil it tonight, but, uh, yo, is that a purple? Hey, Bob, purple Hagnon. Uh, like purple Hagnon. Colin, are you still I watching? Know. Let us know how you feel about purple Hagnon. Hagnon. Purple Hagnon. Jerk. What, tell us how you did that. Ah, okay. So, the uh, I just took the white one. I did not not the white, the clear one. Um, did not use my new blue one. Just use one of the crappy, stupid, clear ones. Uh, took this guy, threw him in a hot bath um, of Ritz synthetic purple dye. Um, uh, I've been working on a little tutorial. I know dyeing figures has uh, popped up every once in a while in groups here and there. So. Want to get something going just to kind of explain the things I've learned, the do's and don'ts, uh, a couple tips and tricks on how to really get the most out of your dye, purple dye, only purple dye. I don't mess with any of the other colors because they're stupid. Purple dye dye. Right. You're right. a man of the people, Dirk, and we're here for that. That's right. Absolutely. Uh, we are just absolutely. To, just so everyone, everyone knows, right, it has to be synthetic. Right, so this is like for synthetic fiber, so essentially plastic fibers. Um, this one, four ninety nine at Hobby Lobby. They've got a wide range of colors that don't matter. Um, just this one. That's the only one you need, and it's uh, royal, royal purple. 
just uh, splash some of that in with some hot water, let it sit for however long you want, usually 30 minutes. Um, I've made the mistake of leaving, leaving things in all overnight. And it's, you know, the longer you leave it, the darker it is, depending on the type of plastic, but you know, we'll get into that another time, so. Why do we have to wait later? Yeah, there's no time like the present. I'm curious. Uh, do we have a I'm first place? Learn. We have a we have a first place um, winner. Oh my! Oh Jesus, you're right. Can we get back that plastic. Oh my goodness, he's absolutely right. I felt so he was um, being shifty there. Yeah, yeah. So we'll uh, get into that at a later time. But your, uh, uh, your Hobby Lobby trip is probably not going to happen tomorrow because they love the Jesus and they are not open on Sundays. So maybe Monday. Wow. I hope we don't steal my Jesus. My old man stole my Jesus. So, ba -ba -ba -ba, first place winner, Jamie, Jamie Sutter. Sutter. Uh, Jamie rocks. Jamie is Congrats. wonderful. Troll, troll Good uh, people. Good model troll. of a human being. She's great. Yeah. She's great. We love Jamie. We love Paul. <laughs> They're beautiful. Great people. Look at this goat goat. Good what bad. you got on this? Good people. This, yeah, so this um, couple part swaps here looks like the Bardrick. I don't, I'm terrible with names. I just. Yeah. No, no, you're right it. on. That was Bardrick. Sure. Right. Okay, all right. Yeah, Bardrick body, threw some hooves on. The, I, I believe that head is one of their designs uh, over oh, at Red Bar? Studios. It's, I, I should have, I should have grabbed a, uh, like a closer Mark. picture of the head because the head is uh, awesome. That is Mark a uh, Mark Rivera sculpt. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, Mark Thank Rivera. You. Thank you. And we Appreciate love it. Mark. And we love Mark sculpts. He's wonderful. His yes. whole family is wonderful. Absolutely. Yeah. Great people. And the magic that Jamie did with Mark's head sculpt, it won first oh, yeah. place. Super mm -hmm. clean paint job. Uh, the pipe, little pipe in his hand there. I keep yeah. I keep moving the mouse on my uh, on my computer and like like you guys try and zoom in. But yeah, no, I like the way yeah, you move yeah. it. But uh... oh, okay, there we are. Uh, oh, yep, those sorry. in the chat, can we get some purple hearts for the Suts? Just wonderful people. They they bring a lot to community. Always in a great mood. They just absolutely lovely people. So they they deserve they all the love we can give them. There it is. Um, all around, you know, Paul is multi talented in every single way. He does absolutely amazing customs. He does great artwork. He does great toy reviews. He forges swords. Yeah, he does. You He's know, a deadly individual. He on, but, so, yeah. Forged in fire. fire. Yeah. fire. Yeah. I I watch the shit out of that show. I love it. And right, it right. Great? You know, had no like, idea he was on. This might be a, a future segue into art that inspires in a future week for Paul Sutt because yeah. he really is a renaissance man. And we're not talking oh, Danny yeah. DeVito. No, no. So um, <laughs> you know, and Jamie. Jamie is absolutely brilliant and talented in so many ways as well. I mean, look at this sweet oh, yeah. good custom. It's beautiful. She makes baby dolls. She's a sweetheart. She has such a beautiful soul. Just a wonderful human Definitely being. Definitely. She deserves a power this. couple. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Super Definitely talented. Definitely a power couple. Definitely a power couple, for sure. Did we send Jason a link? This morning, for sure. Okay. Absolutely. Um, um, hey guys, I, I'm I'm sorry. Uh, I got to I've been so enthralled by this contest. It, we're we're over an hour in, and and there's something we haven't talked about. Oh, what would that be? I know what it is. You know what Thank that? You. you know what that segue is? Yeah. Thanks, Jordan. Oh, hold up. And this show might go a little bit longer than normal, Curtis. So is it like, about adult well, incontinence? It is. Um, <laughs> it's. So this is actually, we have a new sponsor. It's adult diapers. Just kidding. Um, this is. Uh, it depends. This it is, depends. You may not be joking. Hashtag depends, but, but not enough people joke. talk about Brett Stoddard's photography. We love Brett in every single way. We do. Brett is a wonderful human being. He has experienced the ups and the downs with life. He is a hero. He is inspiring. He's a beautiful person. Um, you know, he deals with everyday interactions and, and the struggles of life like every last one of us. 
he is one of those strong individuals that can kind of like bury that deep down. But Brett needs your love, just like every last one of us needs your love. So please drop those purple hearts in the chat for Brett and Brett Stoddard. He is an absolute icon and hero and the integral part of the purple community community. And we just oh, yeah. want to tell him how much we love him in every single way. He ain't a killer, but don't push him. Yeah. <laughs> you know, he's one of those guys, like, I don't, I don't think I'd want to see him upset. Because he, he is, he is such a teddy bear. I don't want to see anybody but, upset, but yeah, no, definitely not him. No, definitely but, not him. There's thousands of yeah. holes dug around Vegas, you know, shout out casino. But um, this week's uh, Brett Stoddard photography is another Chernobyl shot. Ooh. Um, this is actually taken from the Chernobyl exclusion zone. I've been or, there. You have not been there. Uh, I played Call of Duty. I have it. I you, have absolutely been to Pripyat. We've you, had this discussion. You know about the pool. I lived it. You know about the pool. No, but you this can right actually here, look at this. If, look at this photo. If you play and somebody in the chat, if I'm wrong, but if you play not the, uh, not the, I'm um, a boomer, not the online portion, but the actual campaign. You run past that that Ferris wheel and and the shit. He's in the second one. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, and You're, you have to crawl in the weeds and like all the, the like the, Russian soldiers. The are rum raisin you got stuff. from Japan. Next time, go hard in the paint. I, I'm I'm gonna go ahead and enjoy it now. And let's just give everybody like ten seconds of this photo on mm. screen as a big as they can silence. get. A moment of silence, if you will. Love, Watch love. It. And for the people that are listening, they can't watch it. This is a dope Ferris wheel. Mm. It's a black and white shot. You got a tree line to your left, a, a tree line behind the Ferris wheel. It's beautiful. It speaks to you. Life would be a whole lot worse. Mm -hmm. If you close your eyes right now, there's probably a clown that will appear in front of your eyes before you open them. So check this out. Moment of silence. Brett Stoddart, we love you. Hey, we're not stalling here. We really wanted everybody just to get a, a, a big stalling. <laughs> yeah, no, that was a good pun. That was yeah. an absolutely great pun all around. But um, yeah, Brett, we love you. Uh, yada yada yada. Rum raisin chocolates mm. sent to us from dirt, mm. straight from uh, straight from the far east, land of the rising sun. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, wonderful. But yeah, big shout out Brett Stoddard. As always, you're a, you're a real one. We love yeah, you, bro. Awesome one. Yeah, you just take great photos. I think There's you no can about uh, it. you can buy his you can buy his photography, can't you? On the um... oh my goodness, I believe you might be right. I'm so glad you mentioned that. Mm -hmm. um, check out uh, Tidy Photography on Facebook. There's actually a link in our description to his Facebook page. Um, you may have seen it on the past two or three episodes. He actually does some wonderful prints all around. Uh, this was actually That's gifted that is... me. Hey, I love this all around. You know it. Awesome, 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 awesome picture. Like love we've it. mentioned, if if you feel like your life sucks, look at this photo. Right. Put shit in perspective really it, quick. Perspective. Yeah. Really fast. So he does mm -hmm. absolutely sell his art. We actually gave away one of his prints last week. Uh, shout out Brendan Higgins, the winner of said art piece. And um, if you want to acquire one of Brett Soddard's photography pieces for your own collection, shoot him a DM. He'll let you know absolutely what he has Aww, available poppers. and uh, what he can't get for you. Oh, my God. That is such a sweet doggo. Right. Hey, Bubba. Uh, this is Hugo. Hugo. Aww. Named after Mira Hugo Weaving. You're just an amazing, Mira. He's one of the uh, – Hugo off of um, Lost. Hugo Reyes. He's, yeah. he's a little thin to be Hugo Reyes, but, you know. Oh, oh look man. at the yeah. piece of this. Oh, I want he's that been, puppy in my been life. Sleeping. This is this is the first first time I've seen him awake. How old is since, Hugo? Uh, like, uh, 13. What? Looks like a puppy, but he's, uh, yeah, he he's, does. Like, he's an old man. Sweet he's little dude. Boy. Look at him. He's so happy. Is Hugo a oh, yeah. dirt design? Yeah, did you make him? He's one of the four. Written? Yeah, he's one of the four. Yeah. Have you made a uh, custom for him yet? 
Look at that Not little yet. dude. He's just so yet. sweet. Yeah. Oh my god, I love him. He's so great. Mm. I like the pups. Hugo so Hugo loves love. He's just uh yeah. Uh, he's leaning into it. No, I like that a lot. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I'm partial to the puppies. Yeah. Me too. Me too. So there's three more know, running around, but they don't come upstairs. So is one of the three more running around a raccoon? I wish. I wish. One day. We no. wish. I no, believe in you. Two Yorkies and another mongrel. So a mongrel. Yeah. 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 Where the fuck is Jason? You know, um, we're not using this, right? But uh, mm. check this out real quick. Yeah, where's Jason at? Um, slight sure. delay on that approach. Um, okay. We'll say uh, ETA 20 minutes on that. Yeah, then let's roll into uh, third place. For the the band's band's music 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 music. Yeah. yeah. Van, Van's muting a mic that we're not even using yeah. and talking cool. like you yep. guys can't hear us. Mm -hmm. But... Uh, I think that's, that's like good the second time quality. I've done that. Yeah. That's like the third time you've done that tonight. You're like, I'm not mad about it. I, I have zero you apologies. Have, you have used all of your F bombs on accident. It, it, it wasn't an accident. I used my daughter's. I used Logan's seven year old. I mean, he gets one. But, oh my oh. goodness. Wait. Another honorable. Oh, 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 oh there we oh. go. All right. Clean law. Custom figure advanced category. Just dope. This is, yep, another honorable mention. This is just another one that such a good figure and yeah we had we had a we had so many good entries there were 60 i want to say 64 entries in the four categories and i i wish i wish i could give everyone something but i think logistically hey, and, and shipping costs but i'd like to give somebody something so in addition to hey, the honorable got... mention uh let's get a hashtag here Hashtag Brett. No. Hashtag. Uh, hashtag. We love Brett. Hashtag. We love Brett right now will win this. Not Archimedes. We know him as Canox Vol. Canox Vol, y'all. If you're all about that cosmic, you know all about Valve Guitar, Book Two, Grave Knight. And now Jordan's going to tell you everything he knows about Canox Vol. Jordan, tell us about Canox Vol. He purple. He purple, y'all. He purple. Jessica, this is one you want to win. He's dope. He's so dope. Yep. Make sure you uh, heat up your figures. Uh, Jordan, how how do you, uh, when, when you get a new figure in and you want to make sure that you're breaking it into the collection properly, is there a way that you would possibly suggest uh, to, uh, when you unbox it, um, I mean, do you, do you like... I don't even know what you're talking about. You know, there's more than one way to heat up your action figures. Some people use a hot mug of water from the microwave. Other people use a heat gun. Some use a hair dryer. I personally throw every last toy in the bathtub and jump in afterwards. Do what's right for you and your toys. Toys are meant to be played with, not broken. Heat them first. So that's my advice to you. Take a bath with your Canox Bowl if you win it. Yeah. Um, Great figure. If you do do the entire wave at one time, remove the soft good pieces. Yeah, otherwise, you're like yeah. set them outside, air them out, let them dry, Truth. and all that other stuff. But um, mm -hmm. enter this contest. I need this Canox Bowl for this customer. Oh, me too? Thing. Okay. Yeah, do it. I don't want to win. Did you, mute the, did you mute the mic? No, but if I win, it's it's like awkward, and I got to pretend I didn't win. They can't hear me talking if I cover did, my mouth. Did you use the purple gang gang account too, or no, no, no? Yeah, no, so we got yeah. Drop hashtag We Love Brett in the comments, and let's go ahead and spin that wheel. I'm still entering. Oh, after he enters, just change. Moment. Let's change the hashtag. So that I thought way. we already did. I'm in. Yeah. Is that a fake screen that we're sharing? I hope it is. All right. Pre-recorded. Um, it looks like um, we'll give it a few more minutes. I'm just mm. I'm just messing Gosh. around. We do love we do love Brett though. Um, oh, oh, you wanted me to get to Purple Gang Gang too. Um, uh, but uh, let's there. see here. We I mean, just uh, checked out that dope advanced custom by Quinn uh, Law. How do I get into our? It's own probably a good time to show the third place winner of the advanced mm -hmm. custom contest keep doing that let's see what yeah. we got 
Oh shit. Andrew is, Andrew Mangus Mangus. I'm gonna Is that Andrew. the Mandalorian Illustrated Figs? If you're it, watching, let us know. It is Boba Fett. Cosmic it's Legions Boba, Boba Fett. Fett. Absolutely love this one. Same thing. Um Boba Fett's always been my favorite, so there's there's that. But some of the little details that he added, like I'm not sure where the piece is from, but on his pauldron, he took a Mythic Legion strap and then added like a red oh, skull strap. to represent the the Mando mammoth skull kind of thing. And then his like viewfinder that comes down, he used um, one of the bits from um, Rogue Printing Machine, which is actually um, this piece, this little. When you say Red Skull, are, are we talking oh, like shit. Nazi Germany, Nazi Germany, Captain America, the little? No, we're not talking cube? Clay. I Ian. think we're not I talking think. MCU. All right, cool. Just well, I wanted I to clarify. I think about. it's like a deer skull. Yeah. Mm, okay. So the Red Skull like is from rutting. Rogue Printing. Okay. Is that no, a the Red. I'm not sure what the Red Skull's from. The okay. viewfinder, though, I believe is. Um, why the plug-in port for the helmet. Yeah. I thought it was this, but this has like a little... I'm not sure. Maybe. I don't think I don't think he's on the show tonight, so I might have to reach out and just kind of see see what uh, recipe... And when you reach out to him, ask him why he wasn't on the show, because we truly missed his yeah, presence. Yeah. yeah. We want to hang out with as many people as you can. We love you all. And speaking of love, if you would not mind loving that like button, don't do it for Dirk. Don't do it for Van. Don't do it for Jordan. Don't do, even do it for Rosie. Just do it because you do not want the algorithm to kick in my front door and set fire to my house. Shout uh, out equilibrium. Yeah. One, yeah. One point, point of order. Um, if you've already hit the like button, uh, hitting it again will turn the like off. Uh, mm -hmm. So don't. If you listen to Van earlier and you hit it, then don't don't go and hit it again now because that would that would be unliking it. But if you want to take one a moment done. of the live stream and go to one of our other live streams, hit the like button. I won't hold it against you. I might. Yeah, he might. He won't judge you. He, he, he's he's trying to play the up game, but he's he's a sweet dude. Where are we at on the hashtag? We love Brent. I don't know what you're talking about. There's not a back shot. I wish there was, but the one that he, I want to say I pulled that from Instagram. That sounds like a good hashtag for oh, the I love, giveaway. Yeah. Back shots. Who yeah. doesn't love them? Shout out, Shane. Yeah. Can we get him to hit it five times, one six shoot? Oh, Trevor's here. Yeah, Trevor. Trevor shares the purple brain brain. Even if you don't see his presence, he's always with us in spirit. Yeah, good. So just know that it warms my heart when he shows up. Just I, know I, that wholeheartedly. Yep. I know I had a good week. <laughs> it was a good. He really is. Yeah. No. I. I. I yeah. Yeah. All bullshit yeah. aside, I had a. I had a really good time. Jordan and I. We we conversed about that at least four times this week about how much fun we had with Trevor. Uh, last Saturday. Yeah, no. Great episode. He, he yeah. was, he was great he's a great episode. All around. Absolutely. Very yeah. patient man. He he dealt with a lot of my bullshit and with with with, with grace. And so yeah. Yeah. God bless you. Graceful. Yeah. So graceful. I would have head butted the shit out of me, but yeah, you know, he's a better man. How many That's people do we have watching tonight? Eight hundred and thirty six. Yeah. yeah. Multiplied by 10. 70, 71 um, like people that are like here, here, but 836 yeah. people that are here. Gotcha. gotcha. Where's that purple bot bot? What are you even talking about? I don't know. The purple bot bot. We don't have a purple bot. I need that. Yeah, th that's actually. I guess the, we did have a purple bot yeah, here. My apologies. I recall lying. him escorting Billy into the med bay. He did absolutely. Mm -hmm. He did. Shout out purple pitcher pitcher. Billy Shout out Beige. electrolytes. It's what plants crave. Mm -hmm. 
every which way. Oh, did you want to go ahead and do this uh, giveaway real quick here? Oh, let's do it. Yeah. This probably, is a top. Probably a good 50, idea. 50 and 10 ops hole is going to somebody's house. We've entered an all eight. Sure, yeah, accounts. exactly. Okay. Yeah, the burner account's got so, in there, too. You know, the house has to have some sort of advantage, so don't be mad. Mm. The house always wins, especially if that house is the McCoys and or the Orkins. Jose Sanchez, Jose Sanchez. Sanchez. a regular winner nice. of the Purple Season Live. Shout out, Congratulations. Jose. Congratulations, my friend. And a brick. I will trade you some wampum for this uh, Kenox Bowl. If you're interested, yep. let me know. Yep. Got lots of wampum. Yep. Trades can be made. We were at Hobby Lobby earlier, so we loaded up on wampum. Let us know what you're feeling. And wampum brushes. Or Kenox Vol. And glow in the dark purple paint. I was so happy to see that. I know you were. Yep. I know you are, but what am I? So you might be a, a dwarf custom of the week. Oh, let's uh let's go ahead and hit up this uh first place winner. Of the advanced customs first. Do we have time. a first place winner? Yeah. <laughs> we stopped on second, second place, right? for this category. We stopped at second place. We didn't just, there was no. Do, okay. Place. Okay. Yeah. So let's do that real quick here. So, okay. oh, third oh, place. Third place. Yeah. Good call. Yeah. Good call. So we had an honorable mention. Yep. Yeah. So let's check uh, out the second place and then let's right. check out second what you talked winner? about, man. Boom. Ooh, Jonathan Jonathan Bittner. Bittner. I like that a lot. I like the purple. This That's one, this one, my Heltis vibes, dude. Yep. Mm -hmm. This one has a lot going on, but it all works so well together. Ooh, Keltus female. So what? What would Kel Kelta. Tusa? Kelta. Kelta. Kelta vibes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Kelta. Um, and Jonathan Pittner, he's actually been featured on our show previously as uh, one of the Dwarf Custom of the Weeks. Right, Jonathan does nice. great work all around. Uh, he shows up, he participates, he gets all of those points every which way. Does great stuff, and his use of purple right here, mixed with the green, oh, yeah. inspiring. So big yeah, those little green accents and stuff in the armor. Yeah, so yeah, cool. and I, I saw uh, the comment didn't get pinned, but I saw Mirror mention glow in the dark paint. Be happy to discuss that and wax poetic about that tomorrow in the. Wolf King Custom sponsored Curtis Customizing Studio. So, Mira, bring up the glow in the dark paints, and I'll, I will bust out just a myriad of, of different paints, and uh, I might even dig up some some pictures. But yeah, Jordan and I have uh, had a lot of fun with the glow in the dark paints. Oh, oh. it's true. It's true. Um, I know we said we we're going to pivot over real quick, but let's just go ahead and knock out this first place too. Right, right, right. Because this is like. This is pretty big deal. Mm -hmm. This is a most certainly big deal. And um, let's see who we got for first place in the custom figure so advanced excited. category. And uh, drum roll harmonica, please. <laughs> oh my goodness, Matt Buck. What? Matt Buck. What? This Matt Buck? A, oh, perfect mashup of cosmic and mythic pieces here. That is gorgeous. Cosmic the dragon head, I want to say, is Paul's Paul's customs. Paul's customs. Okay. Mm -hmm. I think so. I have I have one of those sculpts, and I'm trying to remember, but I'm pretty sure I got it from Paul's customs. But maybe someone in uh, maybe Curtis knows. Curtis is usually on point with. Uh, I feel like he's. Hollering out nope, Code Lavender. No, nope, nope. nope, no Curtis on nope, this one. Nope, okay. Let's All go right. with Paul's Customs. Big shout out to Paul's Customs for this dope head sculpt. And if we're wrong, tell us another time. But, Paul, you're getting all the credit for this head sculpt. And Matt, you the credit for all of <laughs> this paint work. Yeah. Yeah, yes. no, seriously. Are these uncount one wings right here? All right. Some spell effects. From the good, yeah, yeah. Good oh, I like the way you zoomed. Yeah, chicken bake, baby. Mm. His uh, his paint his page has a lot of like really cool customs, and he does oh, a yeah. lot with like metallic paints. Um, I was you know when I was kind of going through and stuff, I looked through a lot of people's pages, kind of seeing what what their other stuff was like, and 
he's got he's got some awesome stuff definitely yeah definitely I, I would not have there. wanted to make the uh selections here so so kudos to you guys for doing that it would have been hard to pull a trigger and you know since he's given out a first place prize i want to give out a prize as well because Ooh. i'm an attention whore so let's go ahead and 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 throw out uh you you had a suggestion for a great hashtag I like that one. Hashtag. A walk spider people. What I have here is a Marvel Legends on card. And actually, it's a pretty damn decent card. Uh, if you're snobby like that, of a symbiote Spider-Man. I don't know much about it. I don't collect the Legends the way I used to. But I do know if you go to Ipe, you'll realize this might be a prize you want to win. I know that's right. Yep. That one that one was a hot hot ticket item for a good while and I think it still is. Mm -hmm. Speaking of AWOC spider people, who else is best to talk about AWOC spider people than Jason? Jason? From Spiro Toys. And, and you get a brick with this as well. Oh my Shoot. goodness. And you get a brick. Hashtag break something next giveaway. Ha, ha, ha. Bum, 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 bum. Oh my God! Is that hey, Jason? Oh, I know that hey. guy. Someone shaved that... their beard. What are you talking about? That's still here, dude. What are you talking about? Oh, there it's it is. Never mind. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> I shaved mine, and I was like, "Oh no, I'm still fat." Yeah. Right. Surprise. <laughs> bum yeah, bum no, bum. People, people have been really mean about it, but I'm wholesome. And I've been writing everybody's names down and all of their comments. And, um, you know, an elephant you, like, never forgets. Speaking of elephants. Like on, like on right? um, Happy Gilmore. Billy Madison. Billy yes. Madison. Valley, like, Bill, Mark, yeah, Billy Madison. Marking through the list. Like, I yep. forgive yep. you. <laughs> but, do I, but do I forgive you? Hmm. So, you Jason, know, thanks for joining us tonight. Thanks um, for having me. Hey, bro. You know, we've been seeing you everywhere lately, which we love. We've been we've been around a little bit, kind of spreading the word about this little Kickstarter we got going on for some some AWOC action figures. You know what? I'm going to be an asshole for a second. So today, for a um, second, today, yeah, no, I, I don't stop. No, I was trying to protect <laughs> wholesome. I was trying to protect wholesome. my permahards. And Jordan, do you not remember me ransacking my bag of stickers trying to find? He was looking representation. for a good two hours to find a an a walk, a walk sticker. To I, cover I his wanted to rep you guys, and and I was not able to. Um, so I I need a sticker, mm -hmm. Jason. That was the closest if, thing. If you want to stick we'll yeah, you up, no. yeah. I like that T-shirt, by the way. That's awesome. I just noticed what yeah. it was. Yeah, well, shout out to Red for Custom. Are y'all going to Joe Fest or yeah. no? Yeah, we will be there. You know, we'll uh -huh. be there. We'll see you at. We'll uh, have Joe stickers. Fest. We'll do. We'll do the stickers at Joe Fest. Nice. Yeah, I, I think that was on me because you had stickers out there, and I always feel weird about grabbing stickers like when I'm just walking by a booth. Even though I, I, I ended up um, buying your uh, your display figures, you had already sold out, and and I went ahead and got them off of you. I still have the broken. Um, the hammers he's wielding those dual oh, wielding yeah. those but yeah that's awesome i, I, I should have grabbed stickers and i didn't so that's on me you had them out there you, you know what so there's there's all kind of different customers that come by the booth and there's the kind that just don't want to talk and just want to look so we've got like the stickers out and stuff that had like the comic book on the back and uh we want to cater to everyone i like to talk to everyone but you know for the people that don't want that just kind of want to like sneak in and just grab a little something and check it out later on. That's that's essentially right. catering to them, you know? And you guys are, like, super friendly. I mean, you are, like, waiting for somebody to say hello. I mean, I, that's one thing I, I, I can say, you know, prior to even, you know, learning about your line, you guys are just, like, super happy, super friendly, just having a great time. And <laughs> it, it's like a party when you walk past your table. You guys, you guys yeah, are man. You got a vibe. Amazing you got a vibe. Of people to join you. Every time we see you at shows, it's just like, yo, Jason's going to be here. And he brought his, his band Let's of have awesome some fun. people. Yeah. Yes. Well, I, I, it's almost aggressively happy. That, that's I'll valid. No, I, I feel people. that. I will attest to that. <laughs> yeah. Wholesome. Wholesome yeah. in everywhere, in every single way. 
So tell us about this wholesome Kickstarter you got going on right now. And yeah. Jason, so talk to us uh, about it completely uninterrupted. Give him, give him the absolute floor. Okay. So we're doing our second series of AWOC figures at six inch scale. Um, they feature all the same articulation as the last time. However, they will be pinless. So we're going to go pinless on these figures. Uh, some of the figures are going to include moving jaws. That'll be the lizards. Uh, and then we have two characters that actually have other parts of the head that move. So we've got a chameleon that's got eyeballs that move. We've got a rabbit that's got posable ears. Uh, we're featuring four different body types. So we've got the uh, the reptiles, the brawlers, the female figures, and the speedsters. Uh, and there's three of those characters in each one of those body types. So I think we're up to like 12 figures so far. And we're a little less than 8,000 away from unlocking an additional body type, which is the bird figures. Uh, we've also got four different... Um, Weapon sets that each of them are kind of targeted towards, uh, you know, like the lizards or the reptiles uh, or the brawlers, uh, but they'll go great with anything that you have in your collection. You know, I, I personally plan on using a lot of the stuff from my mythic stuff and my uh, master's collection. I might even kind of throw them in a little bit of Marvel Legends, maybe some G.I. Joe classified stuff as well. Uh, so, yeah, there's a little bit of something for everyone. If, you, if you're into anthropomorphic action figures, this is. This is the Kickstarter to back. Um, you don't get back. You don't get billed until the 17th. So there's really no need if you're excited about it or if you're like on the fence about it. You don't get back. You don't get billed until the 17th. So you can kind of back it now, pick out what you're excited about, and just kind of hang out and watch us show off uh, images as we update uh, 2D art into the 3D sculpts. And that's my spiel. That was a wonderful spiel. But I want to hear one more spiel. Yeah. Um, I do. But I want to hear like it spiels. from our Adam. dude, Adam. Is Adam going to give a spiel? Adam. <laughs> this was your Adam. Spiel, yeah. bro. Spiel time. Spiel time. Like your shirt. Ba, 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 ba. Purple gang gang. Adam. What's going on, everybody? So the Kickstarter, Jason covered the fun stuff. I'll cover the boring stuff. Back now, you don't get charged until the 17th. Um, anybody that backs the Kickstarter will have access to the backer kit once the Kickstarter period ends. That's where you kind of lock in your rewards. That's where you actually like pick which figures you want as your reward, so on and so forth. Um, things that we're doing a lot better this time around, we are using a third party fulfillment company. So the fulfillment will be much smoother than it was the first time around, uh, much quicker as well. I don't know. I don't know what else we've been, we've done so many videos. And I'm, I'm running. I'm running out of gas, but I'm but I'm happy to be here. I'm excited to hang out with you guys. You you said you're running out of gas, but gas, but I bro. feel like I feel like you got a little more that you can uh, bring to the journey. So go, take five more minutes. Take five more minutes. I, I feel yeah, like you got it in first. you. Hey, what's your um the next tier that you are most excited? To convince people right now to unlock well the next unlock is like jason said the uh the the bird buck so we've got uh raving coming up next that will be a new buck uh that is a bird i mean if you're into mythic legions you know you might be interested in the birds uh they come with wing parts that are effectively removable uh the the birds will also have gripping feet so they'll be able to like grip weapons with their feet uh they will the raving figure has soft goods he's got sort of a soft good poncho and then also sort of like a like a really cool sort of asian inspired looking hat uh for the alternate head so lots of cool stuff i mean i i have to say you know the 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 hashtag no sleep till mamba the whole the sort of the whole movement to get the elephant unlocked has been really really fun and really exciting um that's still a ways away at four hundred and ten thousand to unlock but we're still feeling pretty confident i mean we've still got a few days and that's where you typically see like a, a nice big spike at the end and so uh we're we're still feeling very confident and and we've said this before but i'll say it again um you know if the if we get close in the kickstarter uh the backer kit dollars will count towards the unlock so we will continue to unlock figures through the backer kit 
um it, it, you know we just won't be doing as many videos and it won't be quite as uh, you know public i mean we'll do posts and we'll do updates and things like that but uh but you won't have access to the pricing the kickstarter pricing unless you back the kickstarter so if you want to get that pricing locked in for the kickstarter and then for the uh, backer kit you got to back the campaign uh and you got to do it before wednesday at uh what is it 7 7 30 a.m uh eastern time 4 30 a.m pacific time so just let's just call it tuesday night um i will also say this spectral pale the 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 uh the kickstarter exclusive we're calling them sort of an a event exclusive because if we have any leftover you might be able to pick them up at a con but the only way to get spectral pale is to back the kickstarter and add him as an add-on that's the only way you're going to guarantee to get him you say only way, but I think I saw like a little asterisk that said it might also be available at conventions. Yeah. So if we have anything left, uh, then what we have left will will happen. be in short supply at conventions. That won't happen. These no. translucent blue figures, they sell like hotcakes. They're no, there's no way they're going to last till conventions. Yeah, so you I'm absolutely want to hit the Kickstarter right now. Mm -hmm. Go ahead and order five, Epic which, all is, in. which is the most you can Epic get. Epic right all now. in. It's the way to go. Uh, once you get your spectral blue pale, you can go ahead and match them up with your D13 uh, translucent blue Jesus with your blue Hagnon. Yep. You get that Boca Tan on clearance right now at Target for like $8. Uh, and you just have like yep. a big old like translucent blue party going on. So you can have an absolute force ghost fiesta. Now, oh, goodness. Right? as much as I like a good fiesta, I also like accountability. And, and Jason, right now you have 5,000. 732 people that want to know are you going to send me the iguana prototype that we discussed in toylanta you said that you displayed it it shows your kickstarter's almost over can i get the fucking prototype now please i want that lizard that's one that's my seven but uh I, I i want that lizard in my life i'll i'll have to do a duplicate because we've already sent off the uh the paint master It'll. Oh, I, I pretend back? like it's the original. Oh, so that would be so. Hold you up. should have just not said anything and just printed it. Hush, Adam. Hush. So, Adam Lowe, did Jason just say he was going to send me one? Yeah, I'll send uh, you one. Ah, I'll, I'll send you. One. I'll pay for it. But there yeah, we go. I want one so bad. You don't even understand. And what about the hippo? Even. Can I get a hippo too? That, <laughs> we haven't sculpted it yet, so I can't I can't commit. Sorry, the cat's not cooperating. Oh, hold up. Get out of here. So, get out of here. Go on. So you that me? means you haven't decided on a color palette. Like Kitty. there could be a Oh change. no, we've got that all dialed in. We can we could show you an image of it. We've got the, the color palettes for that's all 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 purple dialed in. Hey, I'm, elephant, I'm, that's, I'm, elephant's got some purple in it. Yeah, no, oh oh please please know we're aware. <laughs> I'm working Sorry, from where I'm sitting. I'm working on getting on. getting something that I think you guys will really really like, and it's 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 halfway to approved. But we'll we more like on that when when more on that as it gets updated. Right, right. Oh, oh, oh! oh, yeah. oh, oh that purple. Oh. Shout out! That's a lot of purple. Kobe. I'm not gonna lie. Mm. Yeah, no, this is beautiful. This is um. That's the, the purple ground. mamba though. It is purple mamba mamba. Yep. You got to say the, the second word twice. Yeah, absolutely. Because of brain disorders, concussions, mm. uh, lots of trauma. But Just yeah, purple mamba injury. mamba. Like we have to hit this elephant, the packet, the pachyderm gang mm. gang. Like yep. all day long. Elephant Who doesn't never love forget the friend. Yep. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and then God forbid, next wave, a bunch of mice come along, and he just like, yo, why are you so scared, bro? <laughs> While we're talking about elephants, I was watching the That's news me. this week with my family, and there was some folks that were out. Uh, I'm just gonna say Kenya, but they were out on a safari, Kanye. and and this this elephant oh, yeah. straight fucked up. That's like nine, nailed the, the people that were on tour and like flipped their 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 uh, Land Rover. And you know what? They probably didn't back the Kickstarter, and they deserved it. Absolutely. That's what happens. Yeah. Find out. Could have got an epic all in, but instead you got flipped. 
You got smashed by an elephant. Yes, should have stayed home and back to Kickstarter instead. Blue pills, and I'm flipping them on eBay. Follow us at Dirk's Designs and Customs on eBay. (laughs) Just just, just kidding. That's not true. (laughs) Not joking. I I, I seriously created an account, and I'm blaming it on someone else. Did we just hit all of the backer goals right now in like four minutes? Everything unlocked. We're getting like three different stretch goals that weren't even advertised. Wow. We. Oh, right. We're getting a purple flaw. Purple flaw. Oh, that'd be. That'd be cool. Purple what? Giant, sloth. A giant sloth. Yeah. Oh boy. That'd yeah. Cool. Prehistoric one that's like bigger oh. than the elephant. Maybe Fair one day. Enough. I'm Maybe. here for it. Maybe. Big dub chunky and squeeze it. Yeah. Um, we will absolutely back beat big dub. We definitely want a Rufus dog, a walk figure. Mm-hmm. They're like yeah. fluffy. They're fluffy. Hey, you know what? Now that we've like shown off the bulldog, we'll be doing a ton of different puppy dogs. So we might have to do a poll on what what people want the next dog to be. It doesn't matter what we want. What's your favorite dog type, Jason? I really like the golden retrievers. I've got two golden retrievers, but I don't know how. I don't know if that would be a compelling action figure. What's that? Where are they at right now? They're not allowed in this part of the house. They're in the in the over there somewhere. Wow. Well, here's here's what everybody in the comments wants to know. What color bandanas do your golden retrievers wear? Uh, one's got a purple one and one's got a pink one. But it's more like it's more like a lavender pink. It's a oh, oh lavender. Yeah. Uh yes. Somebody call. <laughs> <laughs> yes. uh, Adam needs your uh, assistance real quick here. Uh, Code Lavender, uh, bandana, bandana. What do you got, Curtis? Uh, any any sort of purple or purple adjacent will work. So that, okay, we appreciate it. You heard it here first, absolutely. So shout out Curtis. He approves. Hey, have you completed the tooling on the uh, cigar smoking um, bulldog? No, we haven't. No, we have not. So. Is there we a, have can, pull no, up that prototype? Yep. Yeah. Can I make a slight request? No. You can make it. I don't know if we'll do it. <laughs> you shut up, <laughs> sir. Um, is there any way instead of a cigar, could you put like a, a wood tip Middleton's in his mouth? A black and mild? That's exactly what it was. A what? Shout out to the circle K around the corner. Yeah, you don't know what a black and mild is. <laughs> oh, Damn. a black and mild. Yeah, okay. a wood tip. That's like a, a, a a skinny okay careful what you say now no, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice. i almost yeah, said, I almost said uh it, it a, smells a blunt, delicious uh, type thing it's not a blunt is it no it's not yeah no I you mean, smoke your middle you can absolutely yeah. prime and hype them and do all that stuff yeah, with but, them but i mean they're mm, just you know good, just uh, relax with that puff on it it's tobacco product. i'm just saying you you would you would probably get a few more backers if if you said right now live on the purple ganging live stream that the bulldog's getting a wood tipped middletons and a 112 scale pack of i feel like it's i feel like it's off brand i can't do it what why is it off brand what do you have against middletons Uh, my dad's actually a cigar connoisseur and so he wanted a, a dominican republic style a tight so wrap. How can you be a cigar yeah. connoisseur and you, you spit Dominicans? Little did you know, Van's got quite the humidor. So shut up. Oh, Arcane. really? Sun yeah. grown and Oliva V sun grown yeah. cigars. I used to run a cigar shop too. So we're, we're actually well versed on all tobacco products. Mm. Um, Dude, you know what's funny? Like uh, we went we went to Disney World and uh, they have the downtown Disney. We heard there was a cigar shop. And so we like right. walked for like 45 minutes in the rain to go to the cigar shop. Purple and great. Dad nuggets. walked in and he 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 walked in and he smelled it and he's like, nope. And then he just walked out and I was like, you gotta buy something. We walked for like 45 minutes in the rain to get this cigar to check out the shop. That's why we can't have nice things. Right. That's why we can't have nice things. He didn't buy anything. He didn't buy anything. So, nope. He smelled it. He's like, I don't like the smell. When he gets a good cigar, does he use his pinky nail to split the blunt or does he have scissors? Definitely not. To which he smokes, he's a cigar he smokes the tobacco. The tobacco. Well, yeah, I, yeah, no, I get tobacco, but you didn't answer the question. Fingernail or scissors? 
don't use scissors, bro. Neither. He doesn't. He, he doesn't oh. gut his blunts. He smokes them. Anyways, um, <laughs> how about how about that? Um, awkward uh, silence. <laughs> how about that? Um, uh, uh, how about that? Adam Drake uh, sixty second montage again. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, that was fun though. That was really fun. But yeah. um, yeah. Hey everybody, definitely check out the AWOC Kickstarter. It's live right now. The uh, link to the Kickstarter is available in the description of the video. We want to see elephants. We want to see the rhinos. We want to see that dope purple Hippos. necromancer. Like we want that too. Mm -hmm. We we need all of these. So please. Go ahead and back the Kickstarter. We've already backed it. We've actually bought several credit cards off the black market to do a lot more <laughs> all, epic all-ins. So I like that's the, the least that. you can do. Yeah. Yes. That's the least you <laughs> can do. Slide into our DMs if you would also like to purchase some. Jason, do you want to go ahead and say right now that if the hippo gets unlocked, that you will also include a duffel bag of white marbles to go with that? No, that is not on brand, sir. <laughs> that would actually be kind of a fun uh, convention Half exclusive. Bro? Like each year we'll do like a different color hippo until you have like the whole set of four colored hippos that aren't related to anything that's got blue marbles. That track. Yeah. Hungry, hungry. AWOC hippos. You heard it here first. It's a possibility. So if that's what you really want, uh, go ahead and uh, save every single day, every single live chat that you join. Uh, Facebook daily postings, daily Instagram postings. Make sure you drop hashtag AWOC, hashtag Sparrow Toys, and maybe we'll get Hungry Hungry Hippos before you know it. You could have like cool. a more cartoony box too. Like it could have an overlay box that looked like that the Hungry fun. Hungry Hippos. That would be uh, dope. That would yeah, be awesome. Especially that if it was cool. purple. Yes, I'm here for that. That's on brand. Hey, I'm with I'm with uh, I'm with Trevor. I'm Corgi is something that I'm working on for sure because I I had corgis and or I had a corgi, well, hey, but I love corgis. Got the smaller body type. We've got the fox body. No, nah, we got to wait for the the even smaller body type. The smaller one, okay. The dwarf size, okay. Oh wait, so we're getting dwarf uh, no, dwarf no, scale no. animals. Put me hippos. Eventually, yeah. eventually, eventually. Yeah, we're talking about the marbles from hungry hungry hippos. Unlock that hippo. We're trying to get there. We're trying to get there. We want like everybody, everybody comes in and they're like, you know what you should do? And everybody has like one thing. They're like, you know, the line, the only thing the line is missing is this one specific thing that I personally want. <laughs> and my response to them is my response to them is get in line. Okay. Because I still want stuff and my stuff gets made first. That's how so, it works. Jason, right, Jason, yeah, it gets right in here. So look, let me weigh in on this because Jordan, you remember us having this conversation. I'm not going to say what show we were watching, but Jason, you know, as they create one of, you know, your a walk, your Spiro, when, when you're on a show, because you're a nice dude. I mean, I, I'll say that you, you're a nice yeah. guy when you're on a show and you're talking about, this is what I'm presenting. We've worked so hard. We've poured our, you know, our heart and souls this is your Kickstarter, and, and you're you're talking about your products. You want, when somebody looks at you dead in the eyes, like, oh yeah, that's great. But hey, do you think you can make a, 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 a fucking opossum that's it that triggers has, us? Yeah, it triggers us. I, I was like, I was watching. I'm like, how are these people going to sit here and say, as as the host of the show? How are you going to sit here and tell him he needs to do this when he's he's here to talk to you about what he has for you? I uh, just. Granted, you're a nice guy, but pretending you weren't for a moment, does that irk you a little bit? Like, does that trigger you or does it just trigger us? It definitely doesn't trigger me. What I do is like, I look like this. And then in my head, it's going, I'm walking on sunshine. Whoa. There you go. There you go. That's awesome. Like, That's awesome. Awesome. Stuff. Our, our sort of inside joke is like whenever people ask for a figure, like a character, not a, it's not even a character because they're just throwing a random animal out there. Our, our kind of inside joke is tell me you didn't read the comic book without telling me you didn't read the comic book because there's so many animals in there. And when people are like, there was, there was somebody that was like, in issue two, there's a crocodile. Will you make that? We were like, we're way closer to making that than making some random thing 
that so somebody before, wants before just say, out of the blue. Did you read the comic book? Some of us have actually had a traumatic brain injury and we have difficulty reading. Have, Shout out Legion's Con 2023. Have you, you guys put out? <laughs> have you guys put out a? Uh, it's a picture book, though. Version. It I is mean, a picture book. Do, are the words? Are there words in this comic? There There's some, are, yeah. but you can you can follow there, along pretty well a, without uh, having to read. Is there an accessible version of this to where I can hear the words or so, maybe feel the words? So maybe not audiobook form, but definitely. I check Rick out something has an like a digital version on his. If YouTube. you if you want to know the lore without having to read the comic books, Brick something and I have a video series called A Walk Talk over on Brick's channel, and you can uh, check that out. And that's uh, that's going to give you most of what's in the comic book. We still don't cover everything because we still want. Uh, People that do choose to read it, uh, to to still get you know a little something, a little something extra out of it. But uh, we do cover most things that are in the comic book. So I don't know if this is a shot at me being an unprepared host or a shot at Jason in marketing. I've seen you at at least three, maybe four cons at this point. We've had conversations. We've messaged each other. I did not know that there was a comic book. Regarding a walk so until this week. That's your unpreparedness. Hey, so, um, did you know know the comic after three weeks of the a walk road tour until this week, check out the comic. If you see a figure in any of the comics that you've already seen, uh, there's a good chance that it might come into fruition. If you go to your local comic shop and you don't see a walk comics there, hey, guess what? Ask for it. Book owners, have them reach out to Diamond Distribution and let them know that you want to see the a walk comic because they can exactly. make more. They need you to tell them that you want to see it. Otherwise they're not going to put it out there. And if they still don't give you that comic book, you throw a freaking cinder block <laughs> through their window <laughs> and tell them shooting the shelf sent you. I know that's right. That is no, not we want it. Oh, that is. Oh, there we go. There we go. That is the, that is the bulldog we need. The, uh, the there is, there is like the intention is that we can do, like every animal, right? Like with, with all right. the new bucks that get unlocked and sort of all the stuff that people want, like we want all of that too. There isn't really, we don't discriminate. There isn't an animal that we won't make. So, you know, the, the longer the line stays around and, and sort of the more support the brand gets, the closer we get to your favorite species. Yeah. <laughs> We might do a couple we, monkeys, we yeah. Get there, so we're encouraging everybody in Purple Gang Gang Land and and realms beyond that to back that Kickstarter. Epic Look, all ends. Get eight of them. Epic all ends. At least eight. Yes. Let's unlock it. Let's go on this plastic Come journey on. together and, and bring out some wonderful toys. And and Jason and Adam, I know y'all have had an exhausting campaign and we appreciate y'all stepping into uh purple gang gang land and spending and I, a few minutes i hope us. we can oh, do this again thanks for having us really really soon maybe on a victory tour now i like the sound of that yeah. we'll probably hibernate for a couple of days after the kickstarter is over no doubt get in it on wednesday things. it ends on wednesday 8 p.m. Friday. 8 p.m. Central we'll you, or we'll Eastern? Two and a half. Days 8, 8 a.m. Eastern. We kind of screwed up. That was my fault. I didn't realize. <laughs> I feel like that was 12 p.m. We okay. thought it was. You're we thought it was. I was that. like, what the heck? But you're, you're in charge. So yeah, you're like Moses. You can last night. Time. Unless people are staying up really late all around the world. Right. You just heard it here. They're extending it until Thursday morning at 8.30. I hear you, Steve. -O. Yeah. But, um, yeah, everybody, back AWOC. We need our hippos. We need our rhinos. We need our oxes. We need our birds. All and, of it. Um, and then Jason and Adam, they need some sleep. Is They've there, been some busy I mean, dude. dudes. Is there, I'm excited you know, about before, this. Before you guys leave. Scenario. Yeah, yeah, Is go ahead. Anyway, like I know that some toy lines, when they release a figure, especially if it's a translucent one, it has a bit of a stank to it. Is there any way that you could make sure that the blue pail smells exactly like Carlos Espino from the Badass Reviews? Because that quite <laughs> possibly is the most aromatically pleasing person I've ever met on this earth he smells like translucent purple plastic if we can oh, if yeah. we can get a sample of the of his stank then we can like we can certainly send it to the factory 
essence. There's no stank there. Yeah, if we can get a sample and we can get it in time to get it to the factory, we'll see. We'll certainly try. Send them that link. Send them that link, Carlos. Carlos, send them the link, bro. Yeah, <laughs> I take a link. bath in that he, shit on the daily. He has that link like hot keyed. Like, yep. <laughs> hold on, prepare for good smells. Yeah, like I gave him a hug at Legion's Con and like no ditty. He's I'm like, like let me go, let me go. Shit, you You've been smell, holding me for two yeah, hours. Yeah, I wouldn't let go. You? I couldn't let go. He smells so great. Me, let me go. Exactly. I wouldn't let him go. He yells above. Yeah, so. I, I actually made him tap. <laughs> and that's that, that's quite an accomplishment because Carlos could assassinate all of us with uh Maury's in my earpiece and he says that bird. is a lie. Yep. Lies detected. But guys, we appreciate you for coming on tonight. A Walk. Oh man, is thanks for having us. Every last is gonna hit every last goal. You already know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Flex we on. love A Walk. <laughs> last like by the way, the last stretch goal that we have, it's it hasn't been announced, but if we get close enough, it'll get announced. But I'll I'll let you guys know. The last stretch goal, if we can hit five hundred thousand. We're gonna get better internet for Jason so that he doesn't look like he's <laughs> so doesn't look like his me. camera is a potato. Damn, Adam. <laughs> yes. I'm filming from inside of a microwave. Yeah. <laughs> it it kind of looks like it, but at least it's got a, a purple LED that flashes back there. So. <laughs> yes. point, right. We're here for that. You know, 56k, so 30 years ago, but um, <laughs> hey, he wants to good. get rid of those AOL discs. They're taking up a lot well, of space, so he's really, really hoping. Do. That's how our channel got you're, started. You're Adam. aging yourself I'm, over there, Adam. That's, that's how our channel got started. Yeah. I'm yeah. not getting rid of my uh my Windows uh 92 with the, the friends episode included <laughs> on the or your hotmail account. Why would you? Yes, exactly. hey, I still use hotmail. You did yeah, you, you got hotmail, say. don't you? Adam's got I hotmail. I still use hotmail. I, I have it's an still emergency. The hotmail. Thing in Canada. Why change yeah. now? Why change now? No I mean you, you you've gone this far. Yeah. We love you either way. You know this. Do we this thing, Adam. Do the thing. <laughs> yeah. We're gonna I'm gonna, I'm taking off. I'm I gotta go eat dinner. Hey, Same. enjoy your dinner. Right. Thanks for I'm joining us. Hey, well, okay. real, real quick before you take off, I got one one quick question for you. So okay. Um, I, I was just given my first A walk figure um oh. a couple months ago at Mesquite Con. I was what'd you really, get? Lucky man. Um, they gave me the pale um, monkey. Um, That's so my favorite. I was really trying to avoid the line, not because I don't like them. Uh, really, actually, the opposite. I just was afraid of going down that rabbit hole. Um, <laughs> now we have a rabbit. Yeah, exactly. And I'm I'm seeing some of these. So, as somebody that's just kind of getting into this, like. Like, what's your what's your advice for somebody that's getting in now that hasn't got the figures before? Um, and this Kickstarter is available. Look back, look forward, pick and choose. What, what's what's the best thing to do? Uh, I think if you want to sample the line, we've got uh, several rewards that are kind of catered to that. Uh, I, we have one that's like a or several of them that's like a pick two figure, and you get a weapon set. Um, it's kind of it's kind of like just a little guide in the Kickstarter. So in other words, like if you back the reptiles with the weapons in the Kickstarter and in the backer kit, you decide, Oh, I want, I want a lizard and I want the rabbit and I want a different weapon set. You can do that in the backer kit. Uh, okay. But that's a great way to kind of sample the line. And, you know, you get, you get a weapon set that you, you know, it's going to go with mythic or with uh, masters stuff like, you know, sword and sorcery type stuff. So, so if the in those packs, if it says like two certain figures and whatever, you can swap that out once you, you get can to the swap back it out kit. in the back. Or kit. Okay, yeah. gotcha. That's that's cool. Yeah, and I what I would say is there's there's no bad choices, and we're still at a point too with the line. Uh, the figures, I mean, the figures only came out in February of 2023, so we're we're not at a point where, you know, with the exception of a couple figures uh, that are sold out, most things are still available. So pick the species that you like. You know, there's there's no bad choice. Uh, the Kickstarter figures are are great because I think a lot of people sort of initially saw the monkeys and the cats and they were like, I love the look of this, but maybe I want a lizard or maybe I want a different species or whatever. So pick pick the one that that sort of speaks to you and start there. What we've found, and and I kind of jokingly say this, but like when we go to cons and and people kind of pick up their first figure, kind of a similar reaction to what I think you're you're having, Curtis, is like. You get one, and then you're like, "Damn it! Now mm -hmm. I need 37 more because because <laughs> they're they're just awesome figures." Rookie numbers. Yeah. They yes. Are. <laughs> you, start, you start with the, you start with one, then you get 37, and then you move on. 
the obvious thing to do with the current Kickstarter, if you're not, you know, you should do Epic All In, but if you're not, at least back every single purple figure. That way, you're telling the good folks at Sparrow Toys that you good need point. more purple figures. A very good point. That makes a lot of sense. So, yep. Well, th thanks, that. guys. For We've got a lot of purple figures just go around. <laughs> yeah. And we're here for it. We're they here for every it. last one of them. So, we appreciate you guys for coming on. Appreciate you for spreading the good word. Of the how's my internet world? holding up right now? Yeah, you're good, bro. Yeah, you're good. We hear the delay is only about a second and a half this time around. Yeah, yeah, it could I mean, be worse. You're in 1999. It's no big deal. <laughs> that was great right here. I'm excited. He's got to go. Uh, he's got to go update it's when, his MySpace it's when technology peaks, status. Right? So. Uh, hey, tell Tom we said hello. Yeah, shout out. I gotta <laughs> add my new uh, friends, My so. Chemical Romance song to my MySpace profile. <laughs> Hashtag I'm not okay. Um, <laughs> yeah, no, for you real, know, for real. Thank you guys. We appreciate it. We, What's we up, will let you What's back up, to We will let Adam get his dinner and purple din din. And while while we're thinking about yeah, that, I'm, I'm having it, purple mac and cheese. Adam so, made a great point oh, man, about amazing about lizard army builders. Is there anybody you could think yeah. of that might be interested in, in building a lizard army? I think so. While uh, you guys gracefully exit stage left, I do know the perfect person that absolutely Definitely team loves no, lizard no, people it. in every single way. All night. Yeah, I know. Shut up, Alberto. I will continue making my army of lizard men. Yes. Oh, hey! <laughs> yeah, just before I just before I go, at least uh, Jason can do what he wants. But uh, just before I go, what I want to say to to, you know, you guys out there, you know, a lot of people that are watching this are probably sort of in this camp of, of people that sort of, uh, you know, sculpt and design and do customizing and stuff like that. What we want to see sooner rather than later is people start uh, doing um, like custom heads and, and things like that for, for Animal Warriors of the Kingdom. Because that's sort of something that Mythic Legions has and Cosmic Legions has that we haven't quite cracked yet. So I'm going to leave that up to you guys. 100%. I agree. And, uh, and on that note, uh, you guys are awesome. Can't wait to see you guys again. So I think the next time I'll see you guys is Legions Con. Uh, yep. yep. I'll see um, y'all on Saturday. Yeah, I do have uh, I do have a special guest in to talk about this translucent thing. Uh, Jason, if you've got a minute. Um, sure. Here you go. What's up, brother? What up? Oh, 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 Carlos. I'm out. I'm going to keep watching, though. I'll be in the chat. Adam, Hi, Adam, you got good night. macro, bro. Love Thanks, you, Thanks, guys. See ya. Deuces. What's up, guys? Hey, How's buddy. Going? How's going? Hey, I can smell you from here, and I love it. I know, right? Can you smell it? <laughs> my permahards are covered. Yep. That that smells like that smells like manhood. That smells like success. That smells like uh, someone that has a wonderful family. I mean, wholesome. Absolutely, wholesome. Right. I have wholesome. a wonderful family. That's true, hundred <laughs> percent. Very true. Purple so, family. Um, dude, I was I was listening to. I put my friend to listen to Jason when you were explaining about the backer kit. Remember, I I have that question for you. Because what was the question? But the question was about the armor, the heavy armor. The, he was trying to buy the, the, the heavy armor, but it didn't show up on the Kickstarter. Oh, it's because it's not unlocked yet. So what he can do is just back for the price. And then, you know, if it doesn't get unlocked during the Kickstarter, then he can, then it'll get unlocked in the backer kit once we've raised the, the funds needed to unlock the figure. Okay. That's cool. That's cool. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So what's up, guys? Hey, just you, big guy. No, just chilling. Just, just you hanging out. Stay, just chilling. I just opened this shit. Oh, what? That's cool. How old is that? An older figure? 
No, this is the Crimson Dynamo, the new one from it's, Diamond it's Select. Diamond Select. Okay, man, that looks awesome, dude. Also a flashlight. Dude, he has <laughs> so many, like, accessories and stuff, like all these exactly. things. Oh, what? Really? That's pretty cool. And the visors, you can exchange the visors. Oh, that's cool. Great texture. Is it, uh, does it feel as solid, like, does it feel as, like, uh, durable as a regular Marvel Legends figure? Or is it about the same? No, it looks really cool. Uh, actually, I did a review on the Captain America, the new one. And, man, that. That, that, Good figure, review. that figure was really impressive, to be honest. Oh, cool. Yeah. They're, they're stepping up on the game. If you oh. could replace the Crimson Dynamo head with any Animal Warrior of the Kingdom head sculpt, what would you choose? Let pale, me try. for sure. I would Let do pale. Try. Kale. I'd do pale. Yeah. Let me try Kale. right now. Made of lettuce. Did we bring up the monkey from downstairs? Oh shit! I, forgot. I know. Yeah, I just, I want to monkey on live. Actually, I think they fit. It fits. Let's see. Yep. No pressure. The moment you've been waiting for. Oh man, come on! How freaking cool is that? Yo, robot monkey, monkey. I'm here for that. That's sick. <laughs> it looks cool. Going? Actually, the pet fits. It's a little bit smaller, but it sits. It's a mech suit monkey. It doesn't need to scale. There it you looks go. gorgeous. It looks All amazing. right, gentlemen. I'm heading out. Y'all have a great night. Thanks for joining Talk us, Jason. Saturday. We will All see right, you next Saturday, that. brother. That cool. Ow, the cat just bit me. What are you doing? <laughs> Goofy cat. Y'all have a good night. Bring all your pets with you next week, Jason. Have a good night, brother. All the success, my friend. Hell yeah. Jason is a great guy, dude. Yeah, he is. He's great people. He really is. The, He's like I said, his his entire crew is just wonderful people all around. Like Almost Carlos tier. Almost. Dude, William is such a great guy. I was talking to him actually uh, this afternoon. Um, I mean... Everybody, everybody in uh, A Walk is like amazing, dude. Everybody. Yeah, William, yeah. William Cruz Nieves. He's a homie through yeah, and through. Sweet guy. Uh, yeah. Derek, homie. Just all of every last person associated with A Walk is good people. So we're here to support them because they're just wholesome, and you know that's what we do. Oh, yeah. Good vibes all around. Um, A Walk Spider People. Let's go ahead and do a quick giveaway here. And uh, for a symbiote spider and a purple uh, shooting the shelf, purple brick, brick, brick. Yeah. it'll be purple if you paint. Give it. me a second, give me a second. I need something. Oh, oh he, he spun it all right. Oh, this is gone, gone. Oh. La, 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 toy culprit. Oh, he left. What do you got? Oh, yo, oh, you got my a purple dude. gang gang gear gear on. There it is. Oh, nice. snap. Nice. Do I got my sunglasses? No, I left them downstairs. Probably. In the pit pit. So irresponsible. Look, at, look how dope Carlos looks. Right. Carlos always There you go. Looks. Carlos looks dope. Yeah. Hey, um, I have to go to the bathroom. Congrats, Colin. Um, when I get back from the bathroom, we're going to resume what we're doing. But while I go to the bathroom, Carlos, let's see your... Uh, Best 60 second monologue, whatever you want to pitch, whatever you want to plug. The next 60 seconds, it's Hit all us, you, bro. Carlos. Get 60 seconds, okay? Well, hey, listen, you are in the Purple Gang Gang YouTube channel, the best YouTube channel in history. So, just good vibes. Everybody here are like amazing. All the guests, the guys, everybody, hey. And if you behave, you can get the purple gang gang outfit like me and be cool like Van and Jordan. What about that? Sounds good, right? So also, if you behave, you may win something really cool here in the channel like me. What I won last time. I don't remember. Something really cool. Or... You can just drink your coffee and enjoy with the guys. That was good. I think so. That was perfect. We wanted you to <laughs> plug you, but you plugged us. And that's how we know wholesome, exactly. recognize wholesome. Yeah. Because look at you, bro. 
Look at you. We love right. you so much. Hey. You're such a great human being, dude. Can't wait yeah. to see you again soon. I try to do my best. You succeed. Um, <laughs> I'll let you the DM. We're going to send you a package uh, with the uh, thingy thing and the other thingy thing. And um, it's... Uh, I believe he had to step out earlier, so he probably didn't hear this. So you may have to... You okay. may have to reach That's out cool. to him. FYI. That's cool. He's telepathic. Up, he heard me. Hey, guys, do you ever read this? I can't read. He can't read. He looks at the pictures, though. Thanos cosmic it like, powers. Yeah, it looks like Thanos. Yeah, the cosmic powers. Like, I was reading this afternoon, and, like, it was really, really cool, man. Is there any like, way that you would be willing to set up your camera not tonight. I mean, it's late, but tomorrow and read that book on camera and like message it to me so I can experience I may, that. I may do that for you. It's not that big. Oh, comic book story time. Yeah, break that shit down. I mean, we <laughs> that's a weekend. It's that big, is. dude. Yeah. Right? It's Speaking big. Speaking the weekend, shout out the weekend. And the shout weekend. out to the Dwarf Custom of the Week. I want to actually shout out the best of show. For the dirt design and customs here. We still haven't hit that. Oh we no, we got we got one left. We got one left. Oh, so let's make it happen. Ba, 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 ba. Oh my goodness. Show me. Let me put my glasses. Oh, please do. <laughs> Jeez. Mejorada. Mejorada. Yeah. Mejorada. Oh, I missed that. My apologies. Wow. Mejorada. There we are. If you're in the cabal, you have seen his artwork. He that. is brilliant. Yep. He is pumping stuff out. It's it's absolutely That's wonderful. Crazy like stuff. That. He deserves Griffin, Griffin, absolutely crazy. best of show wholeheartedly, yeah. without a doubt. Oh, yeah. Dude, that's really yeah. insane. Esas es muy fabuloso. Let's see. He had a lot of pictures posted where he kind of does a, a breakdown of, like, the parts he used prior to paint, yeah. stuff like that. Um just seeing his process is, is crazy. Yeah. He's from where? Next slide. As, as somebody that? that's, that doesn't have an artistic bone in their body, I, I genuinely appreciate and, and absolutely love. Wow. When, I mean, exactly. I mean, right there. I mean, that's, Carlos, you captured it. I mean, that, that's freaking wow. I mean. That's gorgeous. That should be a mass-produced yeah, uh, Griffin figure all is day Is that long. like? I mean, is that like we were talking about earlier? The uh, Marvel Revelations is that a battle cat? Yeah, Bobby? that's the ba that's exactly what I was it's, thinking. Yeah, that's the battle cat. dude. Yeah, that's yeah. Yep. yep, that is so wonderful. Absolutely, it is. It's the battle cat. We were talking about dying one earlier. Shout out, Pegasus. Shout out, Peter Johnson. Shout. Hey, if you're in the comments, tell us how you diet. But. Uh, and I have no idea what head it is. It looks like he added some fur to that, which Jordan picked up some lavender fur today. Maybe some capes will come your way. It won't be as good as Darla's, but we'll try. And the wings, I don't I don't see where the wings came from or the claws, mm -hmm. but but I got a question. The 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 neck part of the of the bear, that's like real like or is it sculpted? It's like real feather. No, that looks like feathers to me. Yeah. 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 That's so wow. cool. Yeah, no, that, that's Echevarria. Echeverria. Oh, oh, there he is. I got you, dude. Don't think... worry. Yeah, thank you. I've got wow. the Anglo Saxon R roll. I can only get like two out of wait, it. Wait, wait a second. Know. Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second here. Holy, holy. So this was the modern moto modern line i believe i don't i never this was like the only one i have uh his other wing popped off but i do have it but i think this is the wing he used um yeah this was this was theirs and it's fine i bird legs are on the on the back leg instead of the front and stuff but he's got four eyes which was kind of odd so there were some design choices um i don't know i'm not i'm not familiar with this specific one, but I'm pretty sure these are the wings he used. That's the most so classic. It wasn't the revelations then? Classics. That's no, the most well, classic. The, 
this one, this yeah, this one's the classics. I think he just used the wings from the classics, but the body oh, gotcha. came from okay. Revelations. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Gotcha. All right. Yeah, because he does. He does have like a behind the scenes picture, and you can see like the the green, so cool, the green body and ah. stuff. But love that. That just, I'm pretty sure those are the wings he used. That's insane. So, how does that make you feel, Big Dub? My loins. My. Yeah, pretty much. So, that's how Big Dub feels. That's how we feel. Um, yeah, and, used, uh, I want to say he used like real feathers and stuff. Like, yeah, it's real feathers uh, in the in the the, yeah. the front legs. Can we give it the help? Yeah. But you know the feet. I don't know from where. It doesn't look like it's the classic figure. No, I think they might be three D printed. The head, the head and the feet might be three D printed. Uh, what haven't we given one? Wow, that is just awesome. too. Have we too grabbed this guy? Damn awesome, cool. Awesome, awesome piece. So yeah. So his his yeah. stuff is is crazy. He's got some trolls that he customized, and they're crazy. So cool. Yeah, Fans, he, he what are you drink chuckles? Chuckles. What are what are what are we drinking? Yeah, good early ass, early time, the bottled and bond. The good, Ooh. the good people at uh, blah blah blah. Early times. Ooh. I'm taking our hit since you got it pulled out. No, you're you're good. Ah, he's pop eyeing me. Yeah, I'm pop eyeing him. <laughs> um. So, uh, giveaway time. What do you got there? What we have here is, was this a PulseCon exclusive? Or it wasn't yep. SDCC. SDCC. So what we have here, it was? SDCC exclusive. Oh, okay. So, yeah, we got Chuckles. Um, this one is sealed. The box is in good shape, actually, because I received it, and I put my box in a box. But, uh, yeah, we're going to send this to you with a shooting the shelf brick. Ooh. And Jordan's going to pick the hashtag. Hashtag HM. Hmm. 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 Yeah. Hmm. That's how we feel about that. Hmm. 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 So drop hashtag hmm. Hmm. in the comments for your chance to win. Chuckles. He's not a clown. I don't think. He hey, might that's be. a great figure. It, it really is. No, the, the, the accessories on it, I mean, they, they did a good job with that one. Is he it's a really fun, yeah. actually. It's a really fun figure. I mean, you can use him for everything, dude. Yes, yeah. yes. Yeah, he's a good one. Yeah. I don't disagree with anything you're saying. Especially with the beat-up head. With the beat-up head. Yeah, the beat-up the beat up head is cool. Yeah, he's got, like, the, the broken handcuffs and stuff. Right, yeah, but he does. Let's open it. Yeah, we no, play he with does. Him before we send him out, I got one downstairs. If you want to look okay, at we'll yeah. play with that's it, that's a great figure. Really, really yeah. awesome. The windowless packaging bullshit. Um. So, uh, speaking of five heads, door, uh, the Toy Forge Dwarf Custom of the Week. Yes. Oh my goodness! I wonder who it is. Hmm. Oh, hmm. that's me. Yep. Oh, Brad oh, Jimenez. With his super dope uh, dwarf bah, 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 custom bah. 3D printed Man. head. It looks like a Jason Rodriguez sculpt. Uh, one, two, three, four, five head on him. He's got four horns. Epic robes. Epic paint job. Sword looks just, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Dude that sword in. is phenomenal. If, if you zoom in on that paint job, I mean. That sword, radiant, is, I mean, that yeah. sword is majestic, dude. Right? Yeah. That's right? Awesome, awesome job with this one. And you see the sword separately over here on the right side of the screen, uh, as well as in his hand. But um, 
Brad Jimenez, if you're in the chat, please hit me on Messenger and walk me through how I get my sword to look like that because I just can't do it. Well, yeah, Brad does absolutely wonderful dwarf customs. Right. Um, if you haven't seen his work, he actually did a whole great run of uh, Cosmic Dwarf Customs. You can catch him in the Kings Under the Mountain Facebook group group. Um, it's wonderful all around. So check out that group. Check out Brad and all of his customs. He's inspiring. He's a great dude, and he puts out great work. So big yeah, shout I out, love Brad. The, I love the head. Right. You know Who what doesn't? Rem, you know what reminds me? Re, remember the Flintstones? Yeah. I see that. Yeah. Water, the buffalo. We yeah. talked about that last week. Yeah. We did. We did. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, order of the the water buffalo or something. I think I think it's yep. cool. yeah. like that. Barney Rubble has entered the chat. <laughs> we, we actually watch a lot of Flintstones reruns. Like that's been like yeah. occupying like eighty percent. That's of amazing. So yeah, like if, if I'm laughing, it's 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 hashtag Barney Rubble because <laughs> it just it, yeah exactly. Yeah, that, that's, that's how you know I'm having a good time. If I'm hitting that Barney Rubble, I, I'm happy with what's happening. And uh, everyone, please record yourself horizontally doing your best Barney Rubble laugh. DM it to me, and we'll feature that video on next week's episode with a oh, huge I would love it. I would of love everyone's it. best Barney Rubble laugh. Let us Sounds see like your a Barney Rubble. Would be great. So you know, and hey, like, horizontal. What exactly do you mean? Like yeah, oh, like yeah. that. Always. Yeah, the way you should okay. record. Okay. And and by yes, the way, if you're still yes. with us now, Shout please out take a ish. moment to hit that like button. This way is horizontal. This is vertical. Send it to me this way. This way. Um. Yeah. No, and what Dan right. said. Hit the like Dan, button. So that effect on the sword is kind of like glowing, right? Yeah. No. I mean, it's good looking. Yeah, absolutely right. Um, and speaking of never letting them know your next move, oh, um, what do we do here? Um, hey Alexa, play CNC Music Factory. Things that make you go. Hmm. Okay, Google, play CNC Music Factory. Things that make you go. Hmm. Computer, play CNC Music Factory. Things that make you go. Hmm. Did we hit Siri? If anybody's uh, spy devices went off in their homes, let us know in the comments. But big shout out to Funhouse Customs. Um, our good friend Mark Halcio actually put out this super dope Murder Bunny custom. Yeah, It's actually available for purchase right now. Slide into his DMs if you're interested. If you want to make your own dope Murder Bunny custom, this head is actually available right now at the Toy Forge for their spring uh, spring sale that just Head up, by Anthony Halcio. At noon. He's got some dope shell tops, too. I mean, for, for us old heads. Uh, dwarf boot boots. Yeah, dude. He, he made he made dwarf boots that are like Adidas shell tops. They're they're great. They're they're great. Yeah. Good, good, good traction. That's all the words. Good traction. Yeah. I can't say anything more that you yeah. haven't already they're, said. They're great. I said yeah. all the words. You did. You the words that did. were said were all mine. Oh, my goodness. Um. Dirk, I think you had a uh, special uh, surprise for us as far as super dope, uh, super dope something. What do you want to cover next? Uh, there's a few of them. I got three. Got three different reveals. Take a pick. What do you want? Um, let's start with Corey. Corey's got mm. Corey's got a solid one. I'm a goblin guy, and uh, Gobby Gang Gang Baby. If you if you hit up his his page and and read the backstory of the character Whoa. right what, it's a, it's a tribute that, it's a tribute head that? sculpt yeah it is um hmm. anyord anyord it's a hard j is it okay so because uh, i was wondering about that if it was like that hard. that b bj like y hmm. sound or oh, i like good bj okay. all right and <laughs> does. all right he absolutely does um, so, yeah. for those that don't know, it is a tribute uh, goblin design for Jordan here. Yeah. So, Jordan, uh, this Jordan? Who? Yeah, our Jordan, Purple Gang Gang Jordan. Oh, yeah, that's super dope. Of course, Purple that's just gang gang. Yeah, And it's, it's kind of like, uh, you know, I'm fodder. 
this is like a cosmic goblin that's absolutely dope dope but i'm like the you're not uh, fodder in my heart i'm the dude that like provides a distraction so like i create like a two second opening for luke to destroy the death star mm. i'm fodder yeah exactly um yeah. you know he's not really a named character but Corey was uh humble enough to uh to throw my name on there and uh, we love Corey and you know the so, cult is dope, dope. If, if we want to own this head how do we go about procuring it i'm glad you asked i actually saw a post a little bit earlier i think he has like 10 of these for uh order now but uh in two weeks the place to get them is dirks designs and customs.com oh i know that guy that too. is correct yep uh cory and i've been talking and i'm gonna have several several um different designs from him and, and from other people uh, hosting on the website. So for the next few days, um, he's going to get those sent over to me so I can get some stuff printed up. Uh, tons of stuff, tons of awesome, awesome things. So he's a busy dude. Definitely yeah. stay tuned for that. that very, oh yeah. Putting it out. And, um, he actually, yeah, uh, we yeah. actually have some, the, the, the paint, the paint copies yep. of this head sculpt as well. Um, you kind of see it in his full, uh, goblin glory, if you will. Probably took him two minutes to paint. He is a speed painter. Yeah, he yeah. does things very quickly. So, yeah, what's yeah. up? And really cosmic. So clean. Yeah. That, cool. that's he does a have, crazy he does have thing. another. It's so good and it's so fast. Yeah. That, just so you guys know, that would have taken me like three or four days minimum. At least At three least. days. Curtis, do you see anything wrong with this, these heads right here? Uh, I mean, it's it's hard to tell on the screen, but you, no, I, I'm not. So, so. Thank you, it, Curtis. You heard, it, you heard it from Curtis. Curtis is wholesome, and all he does is project love. Mm -hmm. That's what he does. So, big shout There's out, Curtis. There's another variant um, what? that has the ears. There's oh. another variant that has, um, like, it's a part of the helmet, but it's got, like, Dope. goblin ears kind of thing. It's it's pretty solid looking. How That's come I haven't really seen that? Right? Um, it's really unique, dude. Yeah, yeah. I think I that describes paint, Corey. The, to paint something like that, it will take me like ten years. Huh. And skill will be horrible. No, that, no, no, same, no, no, same. no, no, no. You got to manifest those good paint apps, Carlos. Right. I believe in you. You should believe in yourself. Do you believe in me? You know I do. Absolutely, we do. You got them gobby ear ears, Dirk. Mm -hmm. I I sent one to you. Um, on, I see um, it. Messenger. Yeah. I absolutely oh, thank see you. it. Oh, you know what? That's inspiring. Thank you for sending that to us, Jared. And you know what else okay. also inspires me? Art inspires me. Art just, you know, sometimes I'm having a not so great day and I just happen to see something beautiful and artistic and it, it lifts me up. So, you know, keep your eyes open and maybe you'll see some art that inspires you. Here we go. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, Super dope. Oh, Got ears. Ear yeah. ears. I like that a lot. Yeah. I like oh, yeah. that. That's. I like cool. that. It's shiny. Yep. We love that shiny. one. That one I like a lot. Yeah. Yeah. I really. Like there's a huge word. difference with adding those. Uh, yes. And kind of ear spots. Yes. Especially right. for being a goblin head. The other, the other head without it would make an awesome kind of space orc too. You know, like. It doesn't have to just be like a goblin, but um, it gives you some more options in that regard. So awesome design. Uh, yeah. It's a, I believe it's a kind of a mashup that Corey did uh, using some designs from both Jason and uh, Rogue Printing Machine, uh, Kevin. So a bit of a, a bit of a mashup there. So. Yeah. Well, excellent job to all parties involved. Excellent job to Corey for seeing the final vision and, and putting oh, yeah. them together. And, you know, a uh, big shout out to me for being inspiring and uh, all that other stuff. Yeah, yeah definitely. Um, shout out Corey, uh, go ahead and uh, paint one of those up in purple for me and send them my way. I love you. That's a great sculpt. Appreciate everything you do, brother. That is super dope. Um, let's go ahead and spin this uh, giveaway real quick for uh, Chuckles, the... Uh, Non ginger hmm. clown clown. Hmm. And, I mean, uh, if the winner wants me to paint him ginger, shoot me a message. But 
that that that's completely up to you. He's ginger in my heart. Yeah. I'd suggest leaving it as it is, but I'll do what you want me to do. Oh, I win! <laughs> There's no way. There's I no win. Way. This is the first time that, that I have cool. ever won. Spend that shit one more time. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> wholesome, recognize wholesome. <laughs> <laughs> I knew this would happen one day, but yeah, you know, no, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm saving my one win for some, sh for some like, you know, like. Some of that, like that. One uh, more time. You know, that good stuff. But let's spin it one more time. That's funny. Let me win this again. Let's go. And if Why did you win awesome. again? I, I, I'll i allow it. Anthony House. You got Riga a Tony. coming your way, Anthony. And a brick. Hmm. 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 There it is. Hmm. 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 That's beautiful. So it's fitting, we, it's fitting that Anthony was the last one there. Hmm. Right? Hmm. We spoke about art that inspires, but I, I felt like we haven't really, and, and, you know, we try to focus on our guests. We try to focus on, on, uh, Jason and, and Sparrow toys, but I also want to bring it back to our audience. What about, what about after art that inspires? Can we, can we talk about purple toys and stuff? Maybe, yep. maybe just keep yeah. running, but let's, let's go ahead and just, yeah. you know, shine a little light real quick yeah. here on, Shine a little inspires. light on me. Um, I don't have uh, a Popeye video to play, mm -mm. but I do have a huge shout out for our homie Corona Four Nate Strong. Yeah. Your your photography is beautiful in every single way. Every time I see something night. pop up, yeah. it just it makes me feel happy. So Nate, you inspire us. Um, all of your shots, the love that you put into each and every one of is them. He also, the co-host. Of Legion's Lounge. Oh my goodness gracious! Yeah. I think he is. He is mm -hmm. one of the co-hosts mm -hmm. of Legion's Lounge with our great friends Trevor and Bill. There um, we are. But you know, Nate. Nate's just wonderful. I mean, look, he likes what we like. I like see we that got grub. I see that vapor. You know, with the yep. tool T-shirt and right. just like the just like the dope setting and the lighting. Great photography, and dude. That's a, that's the mood chilling, right man. there. I like what's happening. He's chilling all around. Mm -hmm. You know, we've got that, and oh my goodness oh. gracious, we got some purple oh. mythic, mythic shots. Oh, dope purple Arizak wizard right wizard. There. Yeah, I was about to say Arizak's doing his thing. Dope purple that, disabled. Really yeah. Yep. Mm. Is he riding the uh, the, bat, the Batman the, motorcycle? Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Okay. absolutely. Yeah, Logan's still mine, but yeah, I've got thirteen of them in the storage unit. Okay, Just let cool. me know. Yeah, yeah, I like those that a lot. Skull too. On the mm -hmm. uh, the skull sitting there is a uh, Burke Burke design. I oh yeah, 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 yeah! I have the pen yeah. of that. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah, That's that cool. is, isn't it? It's like Birdman. Yeah. Uh, shout good. out, <laughs> shout out, Birdman. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Oh my goodness! Is there more? What? Dope Nate photography here. I have that throne. You do have that throne. But you will is never that Adam, be... is that no, that's not Adam on. That's uh Voligar is that 2.0 or 1.0? That's 1.0. That's, that's 1.0, yeah. It's 1. not 1.0, 1. 1. they're yeah. both 1.0s. That's Vol, the first that's version. Voligar, and then there's V1. Voligar. Gotcha. Yeah. V1. V1. Or yeah. no, just Voligar. There's no V1, it's just Voligar. Baron yeah. Voligar. Yeah. Yeah. Voligar. Yeah, uh, Jesse wants to know your location. Um <laughs> Yeah. yeah, we know exactly. the difference between 1.0 and 2.0 bodies yep. and version 1s and version 2s. But there's two types of people in this world. People that can, uh, you know, um, infer what you mean to say and those that... So, anyways, we got one more Ooh. dope shot here. Looks like Darth Revan. You were actually, we were actually talking about him yesterday. He was in that uh, Star Wars movie with the whales that you really like. The humpback whales. The humpback oh, whales. Oh, that was yep. so great. Yeah, mm -hmm. they saved the world with this humpback whales. It was it was magical. It was mm -hmm. magical. But, uh, you know, just the mixture of the purple and the purple adjacent color here on the left. I don't know you what know you guys what? call that. You're not giving enough 
recognition and time to humpback whales. Is there any way we could get Carlos Esposino's absolute finest impression of a humpback whale? Carlos, can you can you give us your humpback whale? An impression? I don't know. Maybe. I like that. Help that was me. good. Try. Jared, what about you? What do you got on that humpback whale for us? I appreciate the energy. Uh, Code Lavender, we need a humpback whale. Code Lavender. You heard it here first. How about Will? Hmm. 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 I went to the Atlanta uh, Aquarium one time and I met the beluga whales. You know how they sound? No. Um, oh. Hey, uh, guys, do you mind if I pull up a, a quick Nate Strong Please. Uh, picture? Please do, Curtis. Please I'd do. I'd insulted um, if you did not. Because I oh, saw wow. he, he did this one uh, this past week and... Uh, that's a yeah. Darla Ackerman cape there. Yeah. It, it, hey, hold up. It is a Darla Ackerman cape, but the focus on the head sculpt, Curtis. Bill who the is, who he is, knows who, who it is. Who is that? Who is he that? He knows who, who is it that, is. Curtis? Who is that? Um, that's that guy from the movie, The Thing. Um, yeah. With, uh, you know, and Leo was in it and, and Elliot from E.T. Guns of New York. Yeah. Yes, Carlos. Yeah. Um, he had never the, seen that think, movie until this week. The, I think it's the gang gangs of New York. Yep. The gang gangs of New York. You're right. Yeah. Yeah. Dead so. rabbits. Um, yeah. I, I just wanted to show that one because I, I thought it was cool that Nate used one of her capes in a picture. So good guy. Inspiring all around. Absolutely. So inspiring. Oh my goodness. I think we have some more reveals. Dirk, what's next on your agenda, brother? Oh, here we uh, go. There was a collaboration piece. Uh, if you want to pull up that one with Mira. Of course we do. Oh, my goodness gracious. That one, this one. Okay, so that's the first. That's like the printed up prototype. Um, oh, my goodness. Uh, we want the uh, the concept art. Oh, Either or, yeah. We can kind of jump around. Okay, so jump up I was kind of messing down. around with this uh, female cosmic design and just was kind of like hitting a rut and reached out to Mira because her like she's got some awesome ideas and Agreed. her fusion of like mythic and cosmic is is awesome reached out to her after watching her on shooting the shelf and said you know hey would love some input sent some of the kind of prototypes I had going with the like in ZBrush and she drew up these sketches for me and we you know talked back and forth and stuff it was it was fun it was it was a good time and uh the you can see on the front facing one there's like the brain is exposed um or you can see the brain so then uh, if you want to jump to one of the other pictures um oh so there's sorry. like the helmeted nope you're good okay my bad there we go yeah so that was kind of where i was at um and then ended up kind of stepping out of my comfort zone with ZBrush and tried something new. And then if you want to go to the painted one, oh. there we go. Oh, nice. I actually right. uh, was able to get it. So it's, it's two separate pieces. Love um, this will be, this will be on the, um, the website shortly. I will print the Uno, por favor. lid. Uh, I'll print it in like a clear resin. So if you want to showcase the brain, uh, you can slap that on, no problem. Or if you want to paint it like I did with this one, because um, this prototype was, I printed it in a green resin because it was was in the machine. But um, there's, uh, I'll post some more pictures. Um, and there's like a whole backstory. Mira came up with an awesome awesome name for the character awesome backstory super excited 
the other big thing then to mention is um, with it being a collaboration piece, uh, I was talking to Mir about it and 100% of the sales. So if you get on the website and you buy this piece, 100% of the sales are going to March of Dimes, which nice. um, Mira, Mira picked that that organization. Um, they, you know, she was born premature and March of Dimes like really helped her and her family out uh, during that whole process. So uh, she talked about that on Shooting the Shelf. Um, so if you want to head over there and catch that episode from last Sunday, great episode. Um, yeah, definitely missing out if you haven't seen it yet. So beautiful. This was, this was, this was a fun piece. The, the charity aspects, the, the design and the concept to the sculpting, to the printing, to the, the paint app, to just the message behind this head. Right. It speaks to, speaks to me on so many different levels. So, so wholesome. It is yeah. absolutely wholesome in every single way. So this makes me feel good. This makes me feel really yeah, good. Can't wait was, to get my hands on it and can't wait to see all the good it does for the community. Oh, yeah. Never yeah. way. Yeah. Thank you, Mira. Thank you, Mira. Super, super, super fun. So, yeah. Yes. Thank you, Mira. Uh, she's here in the chat. So, yep. Yeah. Thank you so much. Some great people with us. That's so beautiful. And it's absolutely beautiful. Um, I have lost my my track here. Don't, yeah, while you're losing your track, I'm going to continue to. So, Jared, it's my understanding you might have a little bit of pull when it comes to uh, dwarf floor toy designs, maybe. Yeah. 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 And, and I understand he likes to to bust out the AI imagery, which I do as well. But here's what I want to know. What is the likelihood that we could get a Dwarf Lord Toy Designs? Dwarf um, Richard Simmons? Is that what yeah, we're going you knew where we're going. Yeah, let me brain build brain. it up. We haven't so talked about Can this. we get an homage to uh, Richard Simmons? A Richard Simmons Dwarf Tribute. No beard, straight afro, and but dwarf. I, I, think, I, think, I, can, uh, I think I can finagle Denver. that. Yeah, it, converse with them. If it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, it doesn't. But I'll buy one. Joseph, Joseph was in the chat here just a minute ago. Um, I seen them. I seen them with my own eyes. Maybe you know what he just he just commented like two minutes ago. So um, I'm gonna maybe give him a minute before. to chime in, see what he's got. Uh, I want to okay. see him get the dog real quick. Stalor yep. with an afro. That's what I want to see. Ooh, okay. All right. Ooh, that'd be great. You know, very, uh, very groovy, very hip, very, um, you know, oh. Huey Lewis in the news. You heard yeah. it here first. Dwarf Lord is currently working on a Richard Simmons dwarf. Thank you, Dwarf Lord. Oh, wow. You're probably going to have to do pre orders for this right. one because it's going to sell out and just cause like huge FOMO. Oh, everywhere. yeah. Everywhere. I'll, I'll take, yeah. I'll take, yeah. I don't know if the website like can handle, can handle that. So, yeah, no, you're gonna need get like, some more bandwidth. Yeah, upgrade your server yep, hosting. Yep, yep. Uh, you know, <laughs> sacrifice some goats for favor. Whatever you have to do, but um, you know that's gonna be a hot seller. Oh, that's sweet Every puppers. Way. Look at his little face. It's not even a puppers. It's a sweet, sweet. Uh, he's doggo. still a puppers to me. He he's is a so sweet puppers. cute. Who's a good dog? He's a good. Dog. Who's a good puppers? He's a, he yeah, he's a handsome he's one. So so. He's so happy. It looks like a mini Rufus. Shout out, big dog. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, I love that dog. Yeah, it's like yeah. sleepy little Rufus. I yeah, I had to wake him up. So I, he sleeps yeah. what 23, 23 hours a day. So. Yeah, no, Rosie's the same way. Sounds like Van. Yeah. He has um, a he has a heated blanket in like every room of oh, the house. Yeah, Ooh. that's funny. So he's I'm going to tell my wife year round. Yeah, no, that that's yeah, great, Jared. No. Super jelly. Yeah, super jelly. Um, speaking of door floor toy design and cute poppers, I think we got some uh, door floor uh, new sculpts to reveal tonight. Oh, oh, we reveal. do, oh, we do. Know. We have a big reveal, and uh, Ooh, this will also exciting. lead into our big giveaway. Um, oh, snap! Yep. Let's see here. Yep, yep, yep. Um, so let's. I think I have them in order. Let's see what's the first one to pop up here. Uh, bum, ba, da, ba. It's the full set. Let's do the full set. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Boom. All right. 
Wow. This is the uh, bronze crest, bronze crest blacksmith set. Um, two head sculpts with goggles, without goggles. The uh, hammer, which is called the rammer, and mm. then the mm. uh, anvil itself is Agnar's anvil. Which Agnar. Mm. Um, once awesome. once you see some pictures, and I'll I'll actually show the the printed oh, no. version and stuff. It is it's a big piece. Um, which I can show it to to I can compare it with uh, a cabin door. Well, it's not so, right, G. Mm -hmm. It is. Um, it's actually on the website right now. Um, I put it up That's there the right before the show. Um, yeah, definitely check it out. There is. It's got dimensions because um, it is. Actually, I can just show. Um, it's a big piece. Yeah, it's big. I want to say five inches by I think three and three. So and it's and it's purple. Oof. This right. one is, but um, mm. which is, we'll we'll get to that too. But then, kind of seeing, whoa, um, the dwarf. It is. It's it's about waist high uh, with the Mythic Legion. So it is. It That's is a massive. yeah, it's massive. Big piece. Yep. Um. There we go. Perfect. Oh wow! Found it. Which this painted set uh, this is an exclusive i don't think um this will be a one of one uh it is printed mm. in uh the translucent purple um, like that. Moist I, look, I painted up painted up some parts and stuff even the um lenses of the goggle uh the head was printed in a trans purple so if you shine a little light the uh you can see the goggles kind of light up um this is this is our uh, giveaway for tonight Holy um, crap. and just a, a little plug again going back to ishkan um we'll be set up there and one of our friday night exclusives we're going to offer um we're going to print a few of the anvils in a translucent blue and a translucent orange color okay um, so if you if you just throw on some paint and stuff the bottom, um, I do have some holes, so like, so it doesn't fill up with resin because it is hollow, but it's still like a hefty piece. Um, I'm gonna make sure that this hole is large enough that you could actually put like a um, fishing light, like a small, yeah, like an LED something underneath, like nice. a, I don't know what they call those little candles, um, but like an LED version kind of thing. You can put it underneath there, depending on however you want to paint it. Uh, if you want like a lot of it to show through or even just like a little bit to give it kind of a like a blue lightning or an orange like fire look um that's one of the one of the things we'll have at ishkan in a super limited quantity okay is this going to be like a friday night exclusive or is it kind of going to be open up or it's going to be it'll be it'll be it'll be a friday night deal i want to say i'm thinking like five five blue and five orange so um, basically, I got to shank somebody. Yeah, heard. We can do that. It'll be, yeah, it'll be, it'll be extra exclusive in that regard. So we're bringing um, smoke Friday bombs night. to create diversions. We are going to get, um, you know, we're going to get so. so. Mm -hmm. Stop us. Friday so night's going to be. Friday night is going to be a good time. Oh, I'm going to be there. And yep, speaking of good. Friday night being a great time, very few. Tickets left for the Friday night VIP. Right. Uh, check out ishcon.net. Get your yes. VIP tickets. It's the only way you're going to get these exclusives. We only started with 100 VIP tickets. Mm -hmm. um, you could possibly miss out, and then you might be out of luck. So I know there's been a lot of great exclusives already revealed for Ishcon. Right. Do not miss it. It's going to be in Durham, North Carolina, August 3rd. You just heard it from Dirk. Roughly five orange translucent anvils, roughly five blue translucent anvils. Mm -hmm. um, that's just from Dirk and Dwarf Lord Toy Designs booth at Ishcon. There's going to be a lot of other vendors there with a, a lot of other extremely limited Friday night VIP exclusives. And I hope you get to them because otherwise I, I'm quite I'll positive buy them all. Uh, we'll be scalping them on eBay with our Dirk's Designs eBay account. This is correct. Mm -hmm. We just, we just, yeah, I know. It. Joseph just chimed in too. So um, go back real quick. Um, Tiago 
adopted these designs for both heads and the uh, Agnar's Anvil. And then there's a new member to the team, also out of Brazil. Um, Kyle Selmont? Kiyo, yeah, Kiyo. Um, Kiyo. Oh, he's been he's been doing all of the weapons. Um, the weapons expert. Okay, yeah, I saw that. Yep, he's been, here for that. He's been killing it with the weapons. So a lot of a lot of new stuff um, with Wave Two uh, that's going to be coming out. So uh, just going to kind of yep, Bagnar's Anvil. There we go. So there's a couple there's of there. There's some right. photos there for you of that one. Images Absolutely, that. wonderful design. Yep. The really amazing. The, the yeah, thank you. Sorry. They they do they do awesome work. Um, and That's quick too, you know. Joseph throws some designs at them, and you know maybe twenty four hours later they've whipped up crazy stuff. Um, just awesome, awesome talent on the team. Ooh. They understood the assignment. Absolutely. Yep. Teamwork. Yeah, definitely. Dream work. That's what I've heard. And, yes, uh, it does. Speaking of the um, the Lava Forge heads, here is a uh, close-up on the uh, non-goggled Lava Forge head. Um, yep. Badass. But the way you were describing the um, the one here with the goggles and the translucent resin, that's badass. Yeah. You actually showed it to us before the show started. Right. You didn't paint the goggles. You stuck a light in there, and it just it was badass. It glows, mm -hmm. you know, like those dope glow worms. There it is. So yeah, and it's, wow. oh. there we it's, go. Let's yeah, go. I was gonna say, trying not to get it like two breaks, and it's just white. But yeah, it's just so. Um, I think these will get printed in, um, in a translucent color probably just in a clear so you can kind of do the same thing if you want and then if you just put like a wash over the lenses you can pretty much mimic you know if you want like green That's or blue cool. or whatever um just to kind of give you that extra option and i do believe there is an individual or two that does um small leds that like are in the neck of a mythic legion figure I believe that might be Corey Schwarzenhofer. He actually uh, designed a dope LED torso. Okay. The neck peg. Okay. That has a slot you can slide those LED lights into, and Van actually has one uh, in his hand. Mm -hmm. There Good we job. go. That's all you need. Mm -hmm. That was uh, that and this. our first episode. We actually highlighted those torsos. Game over. Um, awesome. So yeah. Okay. Well, there we go. Yeah. Get your hands on one of those. Install um, this. Be set to go. Absolutely badass. Absolutely badass. So um, I think that's what we have there as far as uh, the new Dwarf Lord reveals. And I actually yep. just saw uh, that anvil is based on a real antique anvil. I'm curious, was that base on the anvil part of the antique design? Or was that something that was added like post-production? Or was that like part of the actual antique anvil? I'm actually not sure. I think uh, Joseph's going to have to chime in uh, on Joseph. that one. So, yeah. Your yeah. people need you. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I'm just curious. So, like, like they actually, like, beat on anvils with people's faces on them? Or, I mean, it's a dope design either way. I'm just, the things that go through my mind, right? Yeah, Maybe I'm not sure that, if he's talking about, like, like just, like, the yeah. overall style. That it has like two the two horns essentially, where some some anvils will have like one horn, and then like the end is like chopped off. Right. That's possible. Paul Sutt would know. He's a uh, he does he dabbles, I believe, in uh, sword. Oh, so we've heard. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he does. Uh, he does a wonderful job with the old uh, dink 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 dink. Okay. So you added the dwarf face on it, um, okay. which is still dope, you know, but it's like, yo, is that an antique anvil? Like that actually has a I face on it? Like, yeah, that was the question. Yeah. Either way, I'm, yeah. I'm absolutely here for it. I love yeah, that anvil. That's super dope. I need super a purple dope, one. Dope. Yeah, Ooh. definitely need a purple one. Like purple toys and stuff. The original. So just seeing it, this one, this was the first one I printed. And this one's like, this one's big. So... Dude. It's it's too big for a dwarf, um, just to kind of get an idea. But not just if he's to see with an overhand grip. I mean, maybe or if he has like a stool, 
you know, like yep. hidden behind it. I have a few. You could kind of, you know, so just, but yeah, this is, it's, and this one's heavy. Like I still have the holes, it's hollowed, but like, it's big. It is a big piece. Shout out Hollow Earth, but yeah, that definitely looks like it could kill a coyote. Shout out Rob Zamora. You're on point with that. Boom, boom, for sure. Um, Roadrunner feed, seed. Box of sand, there we go. Yep. Pocket sand, sha, sha, sha. Right in the face. Exactly. I mean, what, that's um, you got to slow them down. What hashtag do we want to use for this one? Ooh, that's your choice, man. Your yeah, choice. What you got? That's my choice. What's mm-hmm. the um hashtag me too? No, just we can't dirk use that. Just just mm-hmm. dirk it. That one's been floating around. Um I like I've it. seen that a few times. Let's go with it. Let's do it. Doing it now. Doing it and doing it and doing it right. I'm gonna win dirk this it. one. Dirk it. If I do win this one, I'm not redrawing. <laughs> <laughs> right? I don't blame you. Same. I need nice things too, so forget y'all. I'm actually creating seven more Gmails as we speak. All right, we're spinning it right now. Too late. I already got them. <laughs> One in 11 chances of me winning this dope anvil. 16. Damn it. I spun way too late. Let's give some people <laughs> some time here to enter a hashtag just dirk it. Yeah, I feel like chance they need to win time. this. Uh, Purple uh, anvil, anvil with a dope head head. Why wouldn't you? Did you enter eighteen times? I, I'm I'm trying to get my thirty second. Hurry up, enter so I can spin it. Nobody needs to win this. I don't want them to win I it. Do, he's not he's not I'm finished in. yet, but I do have. Can't find I have the fourteen, but yeah. On. Uh, and for the people that are still with us, if if you don't mind being ever so kind and hit that like button so the algorithm does not assassinate us while we attempt to slumber. We got the algorithm all messed up tonight, but that's a dope paint app so far, you know, and once you paint the eyes purple, it'll be done. Can I there we go. Yep. Paint? So this one's it's allowed. What's that? What's that, Carlos? Yeah, if I can participate, if, if it's of course allowed. it is. Get in there. Yeah. Absolutely. Wait a second. Hold up. We'll sabotage this shit. You're going to win it. Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> I might be. <laughs> Give me a second. Yeah. But once I get once I get this one finished up, I'll include this one as well. So you'll have a full full set of all four pieces. Sweet. Badass, bro. Badass. <laughs> Doing doing the Lord's work over there, man. Yes, indeed. Like great paint apps, great sculpts. You're just doing like the most wonderful collabs all around. You are an absolute man of the community. So hey, bro, keep it up. You know we're here for you. Yeah, yeah. Code Lavender. Much appreciated. Uh yes. Can you tip your hat in the dirt? <laughs> Thank you. Good job. Yeah, Thank you. Thank you kindly. Curtis is great. That's how we feel about you. Yeah. Um, well, while I'm here, can I can I just say something a little bit about our our guest Dirk? All you want to. Um, I think I might need to be solo on this one. Yeah. Can we get some solo? Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. I got it. Um, you know, a lot of times it's uh, I don't know, it's kind of refreshing when you can find somebody in the community uh, that's doing things that you're doing that uh you know they're they're creating they're painting they're they're being you know just just all around awesome um but they're a jerk and then you can just like not like them like you've got a good reason not to like them how come dirk's gotta be so nice like what's the deal man like i don't know i guess you just gotta like them there you go that's all i got guys (laughs) valid Absolutely valid. I try not to suck. I, I try not to suck. So mm-hmm. you're succeeding. Appreciate it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So yeah. Couldn't hate you if we wanted to. That's pretty much what Curtis said. TLDR. Yeah. That feels good, doesn't it? It does. It does. It does. Appreciate it. Man, it's so crazy the talent from the community, right? 
we have the best community. Super wholesome. It, wow. It really is. It really is. I'm and really, that's why it's I'm just really impressed. It's, it's easy to want to give back, right? Like just, it, it's just easy. Like, um, I don't know. You know, and I believe it's Chester Cheetah who says it's not easy being cheesy. That's true. Just true. I heard him say it at least thrice. Like, um, like cheddar cheese. We're talking cheddar cheese. Cheddar cheese, yeah. I was thinking like Cheeto dust. Cheeto dust. Cheeto dust. That's my fingers. Okay. Cheeto dust. Okay. Hmm. Been eating Cheetos. Oh, my cheddar. Okay. Gotcha. Hmm. Um, let's do a quick little spinny spin, real quick here. Um, for this giveaway, the great great grand prize. But you know what? Hey, no, let's not spin it. Let's do uh let's do a little speed run real quick here of super dope purple toys and customs and other I purple like stuff. Purple stuff. Ba, ba, yeah, ba, ba, ba. Get it. Purple stuff. First we got this nice. absolutely dope um yeah. handmade spell effect from our great friend Charles Swearingen. Check him out on Instagram at, at Chucky's underscore geek underscore spot. He's been doing a lot of great um, you know. Spell effects. effects, yep, practical effects all around. He does wonderful um, photography with his spell effects. He's actually going to be a vendor at Leech's Con this year, where you have the opportunity to get some of his uh, handmade customs in person. So definitely check that out. Ooh, one of our great friends and uh, That's so, yeah, so our uh, one of our great Purple Gang Gang friend members Dub here, three. Dub Dub Three, William Wallace Harris the Third. Always brings the Love dopest photography yep. with the dopest purple light light. We've got Alithia here with her magical steed, Ricky. Um, you might call him Bobus. I call him Ricky. Yeah, it's definitely a Ricky. Um, but super, super dope shot. We absolutely love Dub Dub 3. He overcomes so much and still delivers. The dude doesn't sleep. He still delivers. Dub Dub 3, you are inspirational. We're here for everything you put out there, brother. You're just doing a great job, man. Keep doing so, what you do. Keep doing what you're doing. We're here for it every which way. Mm -hmm. We love you, and we're proud of you, bro. Seriously. Oh. Ooh, who's this down here? King Castle yeah. Seizure. King Castle Seizure, our good friend Nathan. I think you might still be here. If it's not past your bedtime, I know it's past our bedtime. Definitely. But uh, we're, we're trying to be um, cog cognizant <laughs> of not posting the uh, Pop and Swap All-Star photos earlier. Which you had an absolutely dope purple pop and swap. Check out that pop that and contest. swap contest, y'all. Um, but this one right here, this super dope uh, spider. What's the uh, the D and D word I'm looking for? Uh, Drider. Strider. Um, yep. A Drider. Yeah. Drider. Thank you. Strider. Mm -hmm. Drider. I love that game on Nintendo. The ninja one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Shout out to uh, Aragorn. Um, mm -hmm. You know, Gondor needs their king. Um, there it is. Oh boy, where are you? Um, but awesome custom, wonderful use of the color purple, wonderful use of the parts. It's just, it's dope. You're dope. We appreciate you uh, sharing your artwork with us, and we appreciate uh, you just being part of the Purple Gang Gang, bro. So keep yes, doing what you're doing. Thank We're you so here much. for it. Um, we have oh. uh, this little guy popped up earlier, uh, Sir Valor. This was a uh, post in the Purple Gang Gang group group earlier. I like that. Uh, Sir Valor really loves uh, Purple 86, which uh, I wish I had a little bit more more zoom-ins on this here. Did you say there's a Purple Gang Gang group group? I've mentioned about four times this uh, this episode tonight. Is it on Facebook? It is absolutely okay. on Facebook. It's PGG, GG, Purple Gang Gang group group. There's actually a dope contest that just started, uh, I think it was last night. Check out the Toy Forge, get you a, a, a Diver Dwarf set, paint it super yes. dope purple, post it in the PGG GG for a chance to win uh, purple good goods. Yep. So it'll we be a surprise. Them. We won't know what it'll you. be. It could be a speedboat. But yeah, big shout out Sir Valor for putting out these uh, dope purple customs. Uh, looks like we got some, some Hera, you know, chess pieces up here, which we love some Hera. And I don't really like snakes, but uh, hmm. it's it's a dope purple color, so you represent. And so big he, shout out there. He always has awesome like behind the scenes, like he right. documents like start to finish how he does his customs and stuff. Um, 
lots of lots of love and attention goes into like each one of his customs. Yeah, no, it shows. It absolutely shows. Yeah. It shows all around. Yeah, Indiana Joe, Indiana Jones. Jesse wants to know your location. Snakes. Why did it have to be snakes? But um, yeah, I don't like snakes. I'll burn down a whole house if I see a snake. That's like no joke. But I ain't scared of snakes. Like yo, I'll fight a snake one on one all day long. I'll punch one in the face. Like no big deal. I just you yeah, know yeah. they they creep me out. It's not true. Fetal position and tears. They creep me out. Yeah, shut up, man. <laughs> um, shout out to our boy. Trugging Adventures Ooh. with his dope purple uh, display display here. Mm, we got the want some of those. we got the the mouse over here on the left. We got the dope uh, purple uh, yeah, Dwargar Shadow Dwarf Gnome. I think that might be uh, our good friend Mark's head sculpt here in the front center. We've got a dope wizard in the back with a Father Christmas head and this uh, Valak Dwarf body with a head pack Dwarf head and the dope Monkey King boots. It's just it's a great composition all around. Awesome diorama with the braziers and the flames. I was just about to say, are those uh, Carver Custom braziers? Or? I don't know. Oh, Brian Lane, if you're watching, let us know in the comments if you made these. No, he's he, he watches all the shows about ours. Um, next photo. Shout out to Thomas Ooh, Money, our homie Jamal. I don't, I don't know if you posted this anywhere. You posted it in the group chat. I saw purple. I had to had to you gotta have I had it. to throw a shout out to you, brother. So Jamal, we love Sexy you. Sexy purple. Um, we love purple. Um, this uh, stripper dude purple, in the middle like with it. the bald head and the mustache. Throw your dollars at him. Uh, throw your dollars at him. Doesn't he kind of look like Rich from the Euro Legions podcast? I think so. I thought it was him. Hmm. I always well, have thank my you four horsemen. <laughs> May I please have another governor? <laughs> yep, that was him. No that doubt about him. it. That was him. So, I saw him go full Monty twice. Uh, mm -hmm. Oh, wait, yep. wait, 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 wait a second, wait a second. We're I think we on. might have one more dope purple toy custom and other stuff. One more? Oh. Ooh, Steam Powered yeah. Mom. I think yeah. that might be our homie, yeah. Corey. We like I to, know that guy. We like to call this one Purple Jim Jim, but uh, Corey does some dope purple customs. Uh, this dope samurai head with the dope He looks like Curtis. It is Curtis. Yeah. Okay. It does a little bit look like Curtis. Curtis, if this is you, <laughs> let us know in the comments. Mm. <laughs> oh, goodness. It's not Curtis. He let us know on screen. And uh, he didn't say anything, but you could hear it. I mm. felt it. Mm -hmm. mm. 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 But um, mm. let's go ahead. There we go. Let's spin this bad boy. I hope I win. Like I said, if I win this one or if Dan wins it, we are not respinning. Yep, we are sorry. keeping it. Deal with it. Mm -hmm. Deal with it. <laughs> oh, ba, 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 ba. a winner two times tonight, and you actually bypassed yep. the one win per night rule because one of your wins was from the Dirk's Designs Custom That's Contest, correct. and yep. one's just from being dope and watching our episode. For we appreciate you. We have been live for the past yeah. thirty-six hours, and you have been here nonstop with us. So we need sleep. We love you, brother. Right. Thank you so much for tuning in. Shoot us a DM. Congrats, buddy. Talk to us tomorrow in the customizing studio. Join our Facebook group if you're not in there already. Join the Purple Gang yeah. Gang group group, and uh, we will get this. Uh, this we'll pass your information on to Dirk. We'll get you sent right away, and, and uh, hopefully we'll get this stuff mailed out to you by Monday. But it's quite possible the world is ending because I've not seen Tanya McCoy or the Orkins win tonight. So well, well. Uh, the McCoys won on Saturday Day Live. Oh, okay. Curtis okay. was about okay. to correct you there. All is, all is right with the um, world. You know, they, you know, this is late for them. This is super late for them. Right. So I don't blame them for Love tuning them, out. Love them, though. Super sweet. We had a lot of stuff going on. Right. And uh, let's see here. I think uh, we usually end the show with um, what's going on next week. And there was a little mm. bit of a spoiler earlier. Um, was there a spoiler? I think so. Did we spoil? Oh, hey, I know that guy. <laughs> it's it's Van. Van yeah, and um, that's me. Jason's actually going to take my spot next week. He's going to host, and then the real guest is. <laughs> Just kidding. It, 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 uh, Jason's the yeah, guest. I will we'll be here Jason like normal. Week. Um, but yeah, it's fun stuff. C -c -c Crack. Smoke it if you got it. Hey, it's it's after midnight Eastern Standard Time. 
we are both awake. Uh, Van, are both your eyes open? Yeah, yeah. I both of Van's episode. eyes are open. Look at us. We're responsible adults. Wasn't it like once every four episodes I was supposed to be smashed? Did I break that? Mm, the last one was, it wasn't tonight. Mm -mm. It wasn't last time. It wasn't last time. It wasn't the time before that. It wasn't the time before that. Yeah, no, it's been a it's been a minute. So slur you next week, folks. Was it episode ten? I think episode 10, Nine or ten. Who was, the guest, who was the guest on that one? I, I don't. We don't know date. I, think, I feel or, like Ryan yeah. and, and Ryan, Ryan and, and Amber, Amber is the last time I was like sleeping on the table because we had the intervention the following yeah. week. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's bad. It's bad. Yeah. Don't that was watch that episode. That was no, it was, it was shit. It was funny. It was. It wasn't it was funny. For me. It was funny. <laughs> I it was funny for you. Look at my life. You love watching the episode after the fact. I'm yeah. the one that cringes every yeah. time I have to rewatch it because <laughs> I'm reliving it, just yelling in my ear, giving me PTSD. Like, what's wrong with this guy, bro? Like, the dog's locked in a room. There's no way they're gonna. Hear him, him bitch about it. I couldn't watch. I could not watch that show for three days. I was scared. I was scared. I wasn't ready to face it. He woke up the next yeah. morning to a big uh, like I knew. message <laughs> from me, like it's okay, bro. Yeah. Like, he had no idea what I was talking about. It's like it's okay, don't worry about it. No hard feelings. Uh, yeah, no, I've seen the shorts. The last time I I got out, got sideways <laughs> with me throwing toys and the goblins playing music on me. So yeah, but yeah, big shout out Goblin Rock. Yeah, but um, gotta love Goblin Rock. Hey, big shout out Dirk. Thanks for coming on tonight. Thanks for bearing with our another show, if you will. Right. Thank you for sharing your. You're absolutely awesome. Yeah. New sculpts and everything that you're a part of, and the whole charity head sculpt that you and Mira collaborated with. That's like, so great. It really does like touch me in the soul. And and Carlos, I can smell you from right here, brother. Same. Thank you for joining us tonight. Thank you for the invite, guys. I've got a bottle of Carlos downstairs. I'm just gonna like spray all over the fucking house before I sleep tonight. Because right. I want to wake up. To, I want to wake up to that smell too. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> But um, hey, all around, we love you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. Everybody that tuned in with us tonight, thank you so much. And yep. thank um, you. We'll see you next Saturday. And, Major uh, reaction. We're gonna keep drinking until the morning. Big shout out to Hit Major like Reaction. Button. We love you too, bro. Hit yeah, the like button. The like button. Subscribe. We like to have fun. We hope you like to have fun. We like to give away toys. We hope you like to win toys that we give away. So it's symb it's uh, symbiotic mm -hmm. there. Yep. So. And so, yeah, with, without further ado, we'll see you next week to uh, Dirk, Carlos, and, and yep. Code Lavender himself. Stick around. We'll see you in the green room. I wish that I had Jesse's basement. 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 Basement.